So yeah, today's stream is sponsored by Razer, guys. Uh, Razer is sponsoring me for their chair, uh, the Razer Isker, which I am currently sitting in. So yeah, shoutouts to Razer. You can click the panel below the stream or type exclamation mark Razer if you want to check out the chair. But anyways, uh, yeah, let's get started. We are doing Dark Souls 1, 2, 3 with Pyromancy only. Well, for the most part, anyways. <laughs> oh, shoot. You know what? It's fine. This is an optimal chat. Oh my god, the run is ruined. Touch the demon inside me. I still had Hollow Knight music playing. Pretty red. I don't want to go human. Yeah, this is a nice color. Cracked round shield. Iron Man's really gets screwed with his starting stuff. Shield sucks. is a better shield than that. Might be, honestly. That first one was gonna miss me too, actually. <laughs> All right, what a start. I don't know why I'm resting here. I'm gonna grab these fire bombs. Though I don't think I really need them. And I'm gonna go down and get the red tear stone ring. Right off the bat. Will I go human? I will. Hey, no swag. I'm trying to think. Uh, I'll grab this extra soul, I guess, just in case, but. Shouldn't. I don't think I really need it. Hey, Bob, thank you for the tier 3 51 months. Am I going to dupe? Yes. Yes, I'm going to cheat. Oh. 
Okay, I'm a little scared, but I kind of want to grab this. Dark Souls 2 is by far the worst for Pyro only, though luckily we have the Attunement Glitch. The Attunement Glitch will make things much easier. Oh, I can actually use this? Nice. Am I going for the hollow flame? No. The, well, I might use the hollow flame for a bit, but the hollow flame is kind of shit. Uh, Alright, so we're going to do some duping now. I should have done it with that soul. Actually. I'm gonna get some health. Just cause... Well, actually, I'm not even gonna kill Capra. Let's just get 45 decks. Yeah, I'm gonna buy arrows from the female merchant. The hilt make me mid roll. What about the hand axe? No? Uh... That is not what I wanted to do. Okay, so you can actually drop down... Here. Okay, and we can free the... It sounded like that worked? Oh, that definitely got him, right? He's free. Okay. We got Laurentius. Alright, 
Beautiful. Oh yeah, you have to say no. Didn't aggro him with the second bomb? Yeah, I was a little scared. <laughs> oh yeah, you- oh my god, every time! You need to say no, and then the second time you need to say yes. Okay. Beautiful. Alright, so I guess we go down... I guess we go down to Quailana now. Is pyromancy so bad that you have to cheese it? I mean... Kind of? Like, I, I could do it legit, but man, it's... It's, uh, it's kind of a pain. Like, the main issue is that it, it costs, like, 300,000 souls to upgrade the pyromancy flame fully. So... I would need to kill, like half the bosses before I could even fully upgrade the pyro. Yeah, Dark Souls 2 is gonna take fucking forever, guys. So, like... dropped something as well, right? God, am I even going to be able to kill her? I don't think I can really kill her, guys. Need her spell, anyways. <laughs> Come on, I just want to do one more cheat. Okay, I can't do this anymore. No, don't. Don't drop it! It was- I saw- okay, it said use, man. It said use. Oh my god. Use. Use the partner to re I don't need to reset her aggro, though. It, like, it doesn't matter. Okay, I just want to get more sp uh, attunement slots, honestly. And I guess a bit more health, and I guess, do I even want endurance?
mean, I kind of do, but it's... Oh yeah, let's get our int up for hidden body. Okay. Alright, we are strong now, chat. Let's put on fire whip. Oh yeah. Alright. So let's go free Griggs, I guess, and then do Taurus and everything. I need to kill the undead merchant. Yeah, the new attack on Titans today. Can you buy multiple spells with some glitch? Well, this is remastered, which I'm not sure. I think you could you can do similar stuff in remastered, but it's a little different. Can you drop dupe spells in remaster? I don't think so. Is there anything heavy that he sells? I need... <laughs> I need heavy stuff so I can mid-roll. <laughs> okay. God, this run is so scuffed already. I haven't... I've killed one boss. Oh, God. Remember when I used to speedrun this game, like, two weeks ago? <laughs> oh. Just punch them all to death. Oh, excuse me. There we go. Does that guy really only have 90 health? Lance, thank you so much for the prime sub. Alright, dude, I'm gonna firestorm Taurus so hard. Are you ready for this? Hey, buddy. Wait a second, I just realized I didn't... I didn't buy throwing knives. Or, I, don't, I didn't buy a bow either. Dude, I'm so stupid. Alright, I'm just gonna go down below. I don't want to get torched. What am 
am I doing? Honestly, what am I doing, dude? I want to reset. <laughs> I thought I would. I was like, I'm just gonna roll off and quit out because I don't want to die trying to quit out. So I was like, oh, I'll just quit out. But I didn't realize the fucking kill box was so close to the ledge there. Oh my god, dude, this is so far back. This mer this is already so bad, dude. What am I doing? Oh, I bought the poison knives, you're right. I did buy the- Oh my god, dude. Fuck <laughs> sakes. I, yeah, I forgot about those. I, ju I was just thinking because normally I- Normally I buy stuff to aggro the guy. Normally I buy stuff to aggro the Drake from the undead merchant. But I bought it I bought the knives from the female merchant. I don't know, that was just so stupid. I, I just I, I just have no I, I really wanted to punch that shield guy with my flame, but I, I could have just used like great combustion. And he would've he would have just been dead instantly. Yeah, I could have waited for the dragon to come down. I could have done a lot of things better there. Oh, I'm not gonna reset. I really want to, but it's... There's no point. There's just no point. I'm just embarrassed, honestly. Like, I, I played that like a complete <laughs> fucking noob. Alright. Let's activate the elevator. So I guess we'll just do Sen's gate. Skip. Actually, a second. What, what, am, what, what, what do I even want to do right now? I don't even have any souls, man. This run really is a train wreck, actually. I'm gonna go kill Capra. Hit him with the fire whip! <laughs> I 
Everything's fine, guys. We got this. We'll kill Gaping. And then we'll go get... Uh, we'll be able to buy the Bellowing Dragon Crest. Because I wasted all my souls. This this routing has been seriously so scuffed. It's gonna do fall damage to me. I gotta get hit by one of these slimes. DS2 brain. <laughs> oh yeah, you can prom swap the ring, right? Though I don't I don't have my key binding set up for that, but yeah, that's true. Forgot you can do that on remaster. I, I'll be honest, guys. I, I want to reset. <laughs> like, I, I'm not going to, but... My god, man. Do it. This is our... I, <laughs> oh... Do I want- I don't even want YouTube to see this. I don't want anyone to see this, dude. <laughs> Why would it matter? <laughs> Alright, let's just keep going. Hey, horny jail fugitive. Thank you so much for the five gift subs. I gotta say, death cam and remastered feels so weird. Like, it feels... Just because the FPS, it just feels, like, so smooth. I freaking I I knew that that great combustion would probably miss miss gaping dragon. I should have just for the final for the final kill I should have just switched spells and used like a fire orb or something. Just so committed.
I mean, this stream is going to take long enough as it is. But man... I'm not happy with how this run started. out of my way what the what the heck is going on <laughs> hey marchy the streamer is look not very speed run that is unfortunately true. You know, whatever. I'm, I'm sure all the people on YouTube will love watching me die. Hey, Mr. Down Syndrome, thank you so much for the five months. Come here, you asshole. so much damage. I'm just gonna wait for it. I He's throwing the firebombs in like a weird spot. I don't know if I would have made it. No bonfire. Well, you get the bonfire automatically. What, when does the game give you the bonfire, though? Is it after ONS? Or after you kill Guinevere? <laughs> Going the long way around. What do you mean by give you the bonfire? The game, the game gives you like access to the bonfire up there, uh, even if you've never grabbed it. You, I don't think I don't even think you need to die. Don't you just need to reload the area? Cuz you get it automatically in the prepare to die edition speedrun, but you definitely don't you definitely don't die at any point. What game is considered to have the strongest pyromancies? I don't know, probably Demon Souls.
Dark Souls 2. That's a, that's hilarious. Demon Souls doesn't have pyromancy. I mean, it has Firestorm, and that shit is broken. Firestorm and Demon Souls can do like 15,000 damage. Oh god. Nice block. Firestorm is magic. It's pyromancy, damn it. Even if you... Dude, having 99 Forbidden Suns still isn't even that good. Like... Torch, dude. I'm definitely getting this bonfire. Am I gonna take enough fall damage here, dude? I don't think I am, honestly. <laughs> I gotta mute my sound, otherwise I'm gonna get copyright striked by some bullshit. What? Smoke. What? <laughs> How am I alive? I'm not gonna... Yeah, there's this there's this company, this like Russian company that just copyright strikes ONS music. I had a YouTube the the you know the you know the Miracle Only run that I did, the trilogy Miracle Only run. I had a DMs uh, I had like a copyright strike on my channel for a month or not a copyright strike, but like they took all the monetization off my video because I had they said I they said that the ONS soundtrack was theirs. And then I, I filed an appeal, and it took a month for them to get rid of it. They didn't even respond to my appeal. The appeal sat there for a month, and then it just got removed because they didn't even respond to it. Uh, alright.
you get the money back i didn't even post the i didn't even post the video publicly until until the, it got removed i had to wait a month to post the video Let's see. Come on, give me RTSR. At this point, no. I mean, I don't need RTSR, but it definitely helps. Ever been to the end of this corridor? I have, yes. When the heck will the Anerlando bonfire spawn? I guess I can go do Hydra now. Actually... I need to go do Sif and then get the... I guess I need to get the Crest... Or the... Abyss Ring. So I can go do Four Kings. Yeah, I need to go back and kill Gaping. Sketchhead, thank you for the nine month resub. Hold on, I need to go human, dude. I, I want to see what human looks like. Are we going to be a nice red color? Kind of like orange. Nice peach color. Hollow was better. <laughs> I kind of like this. No, I'm not going to be able to take enough fall damage here. It's annoying that it's so close. You need that extra little bit. <laughs> that 
that worked. Okay. Surprised. I gotta say, I definitely don't need the Crown of Dusk. Not yet. I mean, I guess I can get it. I don't know if it's worth the time. It takes so long. Well, I can get it. Yeah, you have to summon her to get it, don't you? Shit. What am I doing, man? Well, could I just summon her? Couldn't I just summon her before the DLC? What, does it disappear after you kill the golem in Anor Londo? Well, Duck is somebody who speedruns this game, so I kind of trust him. Oh no, I'm ta- I know that you can summon her after you kill the Golden Golem. I mean like right when you go to the DLC. Like after you get the Pendant. Apparently that doesn't work. I guess I'll have to go back. Bro. Sorry, Sue. Speed. This run is just the definition of speed. <laughs> okay. Me all your spells <laughs> oh oh my god
<laughs> I don't think a lot of you guys probably didn't realize how close I was to dying there. <laughs> oh. I probably should have just summoned her and then got the the crown when I went to the DLC, but whatever. This run is already so slow as it is. Why not just go full frickin' Opega? Let's go do Butterfly before I forget about her. So I'm thinking we'll do Butterfly, and then I think I might go do Four Kings. I don't know. Man, I need to... I guess I could buy Fall Control and do the Golden Fog Gate skip. I'll be honest, I didn't really plan this route. It's kind of how Dark Souls 1 always goes for me. It's just a complete mess. <laughs> like, do I even have enough spells to get, to get four kings? I mean, if I equip fireball, I definitely do. No, I don't have the chaos spells, because the thing is, I need to kill... RTSR plus crown, two great fireballs, punch, spam, great combustion. Oh yeah, this fall doesn't kill you! I just want to get the damn Anorlando bonfire. I don't know how to get it to spawn, so I guess I'm just gonna die. <laughs> Rip souls? I don't know. I don't need the souls. Okay, wait, what did you say? Uh... RTSR crown, two great fireballs, punch, spam, great combustion. Okay. Alright, well, we got... We got everything to do that, so let's go do it. And you know what? Let's also... Come on. Get ball control. Oh no, I'm not human anymore. I'm back to being jerky. Iro only- Listen, these aren't offensive spells, okay? They are support spells, and they are okay to use. Wait, yeah, I need RTSR, dude. What am I doing, honestly? Alright, this is, uh... One of the faster RTSR setups in this game. Very, very fast. 
Oh god. Oh, I quit out too early. Wait, what? Man, you t it takes a while to fall down here. More than I thought. A box. Okay, so two great fireballs punch great combustion. Oh my god, my fireballs are are like... I don't know if I did it. Oh, my punch missed. It did miss. I don't think I'm gonna get it. I did! Woo! <laughs> Alright, we're gonna grab this bonfire because I'm gonna need to come back to it. Now we'll go to Anerlando. Punch is not pirate. Dude, get out of here. <laughs> I will go back for gaping later, don't worry. We're gonna we're gonna get revenge on gaping. Oh yeah, I was thinking I'll get the Crystal Halberd, but right, I'm gonna kill Quelag with Dark Flame, so... We don't need to use the Crystal Halberd. Can you kill Quelag with Toxic Mist? I don't know. but crazy slow. How am I gonna handle Smelter? Smelter is actually not that bad. Fume Knight is the main concern. <laughs> This hidden body pyromancy is so good. Favorite spell. Dude, I don't have a bow for bow, bow setup duke skip. 
bit. Well. Okay, I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> oh, that was terrible. Oh my god, I'm all the way at the bottom. Alright, hold on. You know what? What? Yeah, I'll do the other way. Bro. I don't... Couldn't lock on. This is how you do it, right? There we go. <laughs> what is wrong with me today? <laughs> Nothing's wrong. I'm just making mistakes, okay? My chat is bullying me, Sharon. Yeah. <clears throat> How's Axel's run going? Oh, pretty nice. He's giving some good, was giving good commentary actually. Nice. Overlay didn't break three times. Has it been like, he hasn't been dying much? No. Well, that's good. I haven't watched a Neo 2 run in a long time. Die to gaping? Yeah. Is that funny? No. You laughed. I was. <laughs> you fucking laughed. <laughs> nah, I was thinking about like a bit of chaos memes. Yeah, fucking bed of. Oh god, don't remind me. I don't even have bow for this run. Like, now you're doing a marathon and we're a bed of chaos. It's like a big ass meme. <laughs> Yeah. It's my favorite part. Really great. Thanks. <laughs> this kind of pace is normal for DS1 and Trilogy runs? Yeah, no kidding. Every time I do DS1 in a in a marathon, it's like the worst fucking. <laughs> uh, nice. You've done it. Let's go to the DLC. Oh god, I don't have... Oh god, getting Black Flame for this fight is not worth it, man. I really want to just go kill Quaylag with the frickin' Crystal Halberd. But I, I'll do it, I'll do it. You know what, I'll do it. It's not a pyro. But man, I can't get- I can't get great chaos fireball. 
until like the end of the run. I'm sad. I mean, if I did Quaylag skip, I guess I could have, but. You're gonna report the video. Hey, I haven't even used the halberd, okay? I just have it in my inventory. You'll be even sadder when you do the... Dude, watch me not even have enough casts. I've already killed Butterfly. Should have used wall control here. <laughs> Wasn't I gonna do commentary for someone's running GDQ? Yeah, I am. Uh, commentary. I believe commentators don't actually show up in the schedule, though. Just the hosts show up. Could be wrong about that. I believe that's the case. Isn't Ceaseless also like immune to fire? There's no way I'm going to be able to kill Ceaseless. What? Alright, nice RTSR setup. the insane strats. <laughs> I need to actually learn how to do pyromat like these for I gotta say for Dark Souls 3 I actually have like pretty good routes uh, for running magic only stuff but for Dark Souls 1 it's it's just bad dude I just have like no I don't have any route And, like, I kind of have an idea, but a lot of it is kind of just, like, winging it. Dude, I don't even know where to get- where do you even get the Black Flame Pyromancy chat? <laughs> yeah, I know it's in the Abyss, but, like, where? Don't, it's got- that's the whole reason I'm here right now, master! <laughs> 
3.6. Alright, what if I put on the... the axe? Okay, this should be mid-roll. Stone pants <laughs> set up. Oh. So long. Oh, did you get a PB, Regal? Oh, congrats on partner. Right, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> the partner PB. <laughs> Dude, it's crazy. You, you were getting PBs. I mean, obviously your PB is pretty good now, but like, man, you were getting PBs left and right. And man, now now you haven't gotten a PB in like a fucking month. <laughs> Brutal. I should use great combustion. Yeah, okay, I need to re let me actually fix my spell order cuz this this is pretty bad. I gotta figure out, guys, where to get the black flame. It's like by Manus, right? I actually should just check a video. I should have checked a video before I started the run, but... Close to the shortcut lift, the one that goes back up to Artorius. Uh, kind of forgot that those guys actually shoot me from behind, even with hidden hidden body.
What the actual fuck am I doing, dude? <laughs> I'm alive. Woo! Uh, good God, this fucking run. I am so bad right now. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I don't know how I live. <sighs> Meow. Hey, Whippy, thank you for the 47 months. I think it's down here. Yes. Oh, God. We've done it. Oh no, I'm gonna die. On there. Uh. Woo! All right. Black flame. All right, you know what? Let's actually go, uh... Well, I guess we can go... Trigger Calamite. I don't know. I kind of want to go get Great Chaos Fireball and Chaos Storm. Does less damage than Great Combustion? Yeah, I... I'm sure it's an amazing spell. Your Tempest. Is that the one you get from killing Quailana? Because I tried to kill her and she wrecked me. I didn't have anything to kill her with, except like a hand axe. Can one shot Calamite? <laughs> well, I can get it on the way. I can kill her with Black Flame. Although then I'm not gonna have... If I kill Quailana with Black Flame, then I'm not gonna have any casts. <laughs> For Quailana.
Yeah, I can get the bonfire in Blight Town. A bit slow, but. You got okay. Ch Do you think we're gonna be able to kill Quaylag with back black flame guys? I really should have bought more than one purple moss club. <laughs> but hey, one is all I need. How am I even gonna kill? Well, yeah, I, gu I guess Black Flame will be able to kill Quailana. Hopefully. It's probably gonna like one shot me though. Get Power Within. Yeah, let's do the insane Power Within strats. There is some cool like. Blight Town parkour you can do to get the to get power within. I have one moss, it's fine. Did not do very good damage to her, I gotta say, but I'm sure it'll be fine on Quaylag, right? Opium. Fine, guys, once we have RTSR... It might be better to use Dust Crown. Is, is it better to use Dust Crown Ring so I get 12 casts? Probably. Alright, we got this, guys. Hey, Jumpy. Dude, I really thought I'd they'd get the dodge there. Come on, give me some fall damage. I need fall damage. Just wait. Alright, we got this, guys. Here we go. fellas. <laughs> I 
Uh. <laughs> I can't kill her with it, all right? I'm I'm sorry. It's there it's not happening. <laughs> it's not happening. Chat, come on. Like <laughs> what do you want me to do? I can't fucking kill her. I don't <laughs> toxic mist. <laughs> Oh. Use Maneater Mildred? That's- that's basically- that might- I might as well not even use- Dude, this guy... Didn't even try- I DID TRY! What you mean, didn't try? I gimped myself by not killing Quaylag early, alright? Get out of my way. Nine hundred ninety nine humanity. Let's go. Chaos Firestorm is garbage compared to Tempest. I see. All right. Well, let me here. Let me equip. Dude, Black Flame is actually garbage. Hold on, one more cheat so I can get like 10 million attunement. Oh yeah. When does the attunement slot cap? Chaos Fireball, Great Fireball. Uh, great Combustion. Chaos Storm, Fire Tempest. Black Flame. Looks pretty good. Do you get mo <clears throat> do you get more spell casts from higher attunement? I didn't even know that. I didn't realize that was a thing in this game. All you need is twelve combustion. <laughs> yeah. Not in DS one. Oh right, it's because I have the ring on. I'm an idiot. I was like, why do I have more casts all of a sudden? All right, guys. Well, I'm sure we can kill Ceaseless with our with this, right? <laughs> he only has like twice the health. Yeah. yeah, I could do the cheese. Dude, I don't even know how to do the cheese, though. The cheese is kind of scary.
just run. I could have sworn I remember he he can do an attack. I thought he can do an attack though. He rips his arm out. Yeah, I mean, I know how to do it. I know how to do it from here. I was more so just scared. I remember I tried doing this cheese once and I got like hit and killed right away. We got him. Is fi fire? Oh yeah, fire sage isn't actually immune to pyro. I don't think. Thankfully. Dude, Black Flame is really disappointing, though, I gotta say. That spell sucks. Yeah, I'll try to use Fire Tempest. I'm trying to get I'm trying to get RTSR, okay? It still wasn't enough. Oh my god. All right. Just Dude, this is so fucking... What the fuck am I doing, dude? <laughs> Alright, I'm trying... I want to use Fire Tempest for Master, guys. Here we go. Here we go. Oh! No, no, no. Dude, the leap damage. <laughs> Is Centipede? Centipede is also immune to fire. I'm pretty sure.
Can I take? Oh, I don't have enough health, man. I just want to try to get RTSR, but I can't. My health is like, it's too awkward. I don't have, I'm taking too much damage. I wonder if it's because of my, d my dust crown. Didn't even try, all right, I'll try black flame, dude. Take a bit of fall damage. Should be enough. In the room. Listen, I'm sorry, chat, okay? Also, I don't have a bow. Touch the demon inside me. Hey, noob cucked, thank you for the 37 months. I don't have a bow, guys. So yeah. Monka shake, dude. Go buy one. So slow though. Actually... Wait, yeah, I don't know. Put the... Yeah, I know, Master. I, I used to do bowless Bed of Chaos. It's just... Every single run that I do... Dark Souls 1... Every time I do Dark Souls 1 in a marathon, Bed of Chaos is like... The most cursed fucking shit ever, dude. I, I, Bed of Cast takes me like 20 minutes every time I do this marathon. <laughs> yeah, I know, not, not idea. I know. I don't know where I would get a bow though, other than like the merchant. Hey, Shadows in the Sun, thank you for the 11 months. I guess I could have also taken the Chaos shortcut. Is the Chaos shortcut actually faster after you kill Centipede? DBD after Marathon. <laughs> no. Should have got the bonfire. I actually probably should have, considering how this normally goes for me. God, I'm mid running. Am I gonna make it in time? Oh no, 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 no. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. What is my walk key?
What the fuck is walk, man? How do you walk? Yeah, I know you can tab W, but my character's gonna go like... Oh god. You backstep from this line, right? The f This right here? Or is it the second line? It's right- it's right there, right? We got him. Fuck you, better chaos. <laughs> All right. Let's go kill Calamite in one Fire Tempest. Now, I'm probably just gonna die if I try to use Fire Tempest on Calamite, but I'm gonna try it anyways. Let me go human. Let's go Chad mode. All right. Yeah, if he does the horizontal fire, if I if I bait out the horizontal fire breath, I can maybe get a one shot Calamite, I guess. Can you one shot him even without power within? I feel like you probably need power within. You do, okay. Yeah. Should have done Gothless. Can you even do Gothless, Calamite? And do four combustions and then storm? Okay. Alright, I'll try, I guess. I'm just gonna die trying this, most likely. I know it's RNG. <laughs> oh, you're right, I didn't shoot him down. Oh. Stop it. Can still do Gothless Mario. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> There's no way Gothless can even I don't I don't think Pyromancies have enough range. This run is beyond scuffed. You know, as scuffed as it's as it's been, we are still making pretty good progress. Like we we don't actually have too many bosses left. We have Calamite, and then... What do we have? Like, Gaping? And... Priscilla? Like, this run shouldn't actually be too much longer than two hours anyways, I, I don't think. Yeah, I need to do Stray as well. Stray, Stray Priscilla, Gaping, and... Then Pinwheel Nito. And Calamite. But like... Oh yeah, and Gargs. But it, it shouldn't actually take too much longer.
skipping dialogue. I know. I'm I'm sorry. Forgive me. <clears throat> so who here is super hyped for Pyro only Dark Souls 2? You know, I should have added a sub incentive to do scholar pyro only. Although maybe that was maybe it's good that I didn't do that. Great combustion. One, two. Oh! I think I could have killed him with three great combustion, actually. Hey, Miter Guy, thank you for the six months. Yo, that damage, though. Alright, let's go to Firelink. Let's go to Firelink and we'll go do gaping. I'm to get re my revenge on gaping. Bed of Chaos, curse was uh, solved, Sharon. Or was removed. It was cured. It's a shame. Yeah, I thought I was on, in, just in time to come with them. No. You missed it. Did it add an incentive for wearing your onesie? Incentive for wearing my onesie? Oh my god, Sharon. Yeah, but chat wants to see you in the onesie. <laughs> you want to see me in the onesie, not chat. So does chat. <laughs> then you can do jammies. Uh-huh. Get up here. Okay, he's too scared to wear it. <laughs> too scared to be too comfy. Shit. Can I can I save this? Oh. Yeah, it is pretty cold. But you're supposed to keep the ring on, aren't you? Or wait! No, I don't know. I'm so confused. I thought... Wait. Oh my god. Yeah, you are supposed to keep the ring on. Uh... 
Come on. Get up there. Here we go, here we go. Speed. Fuck. Oh my god, I almost just died again. Oh. I don't need the souls, guys. It's fine. Hello, everybody. All of them in one cat. <laughs> <My name! laughs> hey, Chup Loops, thank you for the fifteen months. Yeah, rip the sub two hours, though. If it wasn't for the gaping deaths, it might have happened, but... You know, honestly, the ru the run, despite how bad the start of this run went, it, it has gotten a lot better. Finish him with the black flame. I guess we'll go do Pinwheel Nito, and then we can go to Priscilla. Yeah, I don't know. This is going to be like two hours, ten minutes, probably. Which isn't all that bad. I mean, considering everything that's happened. Took two weeks from work for Elden Ring. I mean, I think you'll be able to beat the game for sure if you're playing it nonstop. <clears throat> Just wait for it to be delayed again. It's not funny. Hey, Tiago, thank you for the Prime sub here.
Oh my god. That was scary chat. Almost didn't work. The DS Metroid run looks cool, but the runner makes you cringe, so... <laughs> what, on GDQ right now? Do I want to be a massive peach? I guess I will. Now let's turn human again. can see Lost Isolith right down there. Rolling off that ledge there always scares me so much. The kill box is like an inch away from the ledge. Oh no, not found in Leroy. Forgot about this guy. the benefit of turning human uh there's no benefit this looks nice see my nice human butt Look at the black flame. Oh. Yeah, uh, how imagine hitting only one tick of fire tempest when you're like inside the boss's butthole. <laughs> All right. Uh Dark Moon Tomb. All right, two more bosses, chat. Or no, three. I also have to kill gargoyles. Not sub two hours. Yeah, I know. I, I tried. Why no demon souls? Uh, I just... Dark Souls 2 is going to take a while, so... I didn't want to do, like, a super, super long stream today. Yo, what's up, Matt? I 
DS do Pyro as a challenge run? Yeah, so... To give you guys... Just to, just to let you know, chat, the last time I did Pyro only, Fume Knight took 30 minutes to kill. But now we do have the attunement glitch. So it probably won't be as bad. Will Nightfall have a viable speedrun? I mean, you could speedrun anything. I. That's such a weird question. I mean, you could speedrun Nightfall. I don't know if it'll be interesting or whatever, but how the hell did I block that? Now we go back to Firelink, and let's go finish off the gargoyles. Gargoyles. <laughs> I could kill the gargoyles with just the glove pretty easily, I reckon. Alright, nice RTSR setup. I one shot him with Great Chaos Fireball. <laughs> Very well. <clears throat> oh, you know what? Hold on. Let me put on... Yeah, I did Butterfly. I've done every boss, I'm like 99% sure. Yes, I did gaping. I did Gwendolyn. <laughs> gaping did this twice. True.
How does one get an Anerlanda without ringing the bell? It's called Sen's Gate Skip. And then there's other, there's other tricks you can do so you don't have to ring the bell at all. You can, because of, there's two different ways to get to the, the sunlight altar, or no, not the fire link altar, I mean. Um, and if you kill, if you kill four kings by doing another skip, then you can actually get to the, you can place the lord vessel without. Why not glitchless? Because that's boring. All right, chat. Time for the the best fight in the game. Oh no, you're you're not. There we go. No. So yeah, he he has this weird AI where when you hit him with combustion, he'll just jump sideways you can just kill him from like full to dead doing that all right i'm gonna pause the timer all right gg dark souls one sub 210 all right i'm gonna take a short break guys and then you know what it's time for dark souls 2 baby All right, I'm gonna go get a drink, take a short break. All right, chat, are you ready? 
Are you freaking ready? I'm not. <laughs> I'm not ready. I'm just doing vanilla. I don't want I don't want to deal with all the scholar memes in using only pyros. It's going to be horrible. <clears throat> but scholar is so good. Okay. What, good for watching somebody suffer? <laughs> Alright, so... Alright, I think my plan... Do do Pyromancy scale with Int and Faith in, in Dark Souls 2? I think they do, right? Or do they scale at all, actually? They do? Okay. Alright, so I think we're going to kill Drag... We'll kill... I might start with Bonfire Aesthetic and kill Dragon Rider twice. Just to get a bit stronger. And then we can... We can free Rosabeth. Buy her Fire Seeds. Because then we'll actually have enough to buy the Fire Seeds from, from Rosabeth. And then maybe we'll go for maybe I'll go for great fireball I'm not really sure what kind of like upgrade route I want to or not upgrade route but I really don't ha I, I gotta say guys I really didn't plan too much for this so it's gonna be This is going to be scuffed. We probably want to free Strayed early on. So we can get Flame Swath. And then we're definitely going to want to get Forbidden Sun. Forbidden Sun is going to be like our endgame build. Yeah, I mean, I could do Dragon Rider with Gravity and then go down to grab the branch, but it might be a good idea to kill Dragon Rider twice. I'm not sure if I'm going to have enough uh, spell casts to kill Last Giant. Otherwise... Non-Scholar. God, shut up! Get out of here. Okay. <clears throat> All right, chat. 
So yeah, uh, I guess I'll give another shout out to Razor. They're sponsoring the stream today, guys, for the chair that I am in, the Razor Isker. They've got a game, they uh, got a new gaming chair they released. So if any of you want to check it out, you can uh, check the command in chat, exclamation mark Razor, or click the panel below the stream. But anyways, here we go. What class do we want to start as? Oh yeah, uh, first person to prime sub will get the character named after them. Any uh, any primers in the chat? This is your chance. Come on, there's somebody. LG. Yo, thank you. Dale Don, you were a little too slow, but you were all you almost got it. <laughs> Thank you, Dale Don. <laughs> and Dub, thank you for the prime. Also, Dima, thank you for the gift sub. Alright. Let's go. So one of the best parts about doing meme runs in this game, at least. Oh yeah, what class do we want to start as for Pyromancer? Sorcerer? Probably Sorcerer. Sorcerer's best, I think. Alright, we'll start Sorcerer with... Bonfire... Aesthetic. Oh yeah, okay, so one of the best things about Dark Souls 2 meme runs is that we can randomize our character. Hold on, let me go female. Alright. Baron, come. Get ready for the abomination. Come check it out. Are you ready? Yeah. Whoa. Oh, yeah. What the hell? It's even possible. Jesus. And it looks like a dragon. Looks like a dragon. Yeah. Hmm? <laughs> Alright, nice. <laughs> Looks like you, lol. Oh, got him. Hilarious. Is that Joel? No, no, it's not Joel. That is something Joel would say, though. Yeah. Malden, as usual, is dead. Forgive me, chat. Yeah, I know, guys. Listen, that's the only non-pyro we're gonna use. Alright, I need his clothes. I need them. I also need to light the Majula bonfire.
Listen, I, I guess I, I could have technically not killed Malin and waited until I got the pyromancies to kill him. But then I'm losing, like, the, so many souls. It's alright, chat. It's just Malin. It's just Malin. Uh, this is vanilla. Well, I already, I'm already telling you right now, I'm not going to be using pyromancies in a moment, as well. <laughs> so, because I'm going to bonfire Ascetic Dragon Rider, and once I bonfire Ascetic Dragon Rider, there's going to be NG plus enemies that spawn here. So, yeah, I need to kill this guy. Okay, alright, we're fine. Everything's fine. Listen, there's no pyromancy class start, okay, chat? Probably shouldn't have even bothered doing this, especially because I have Soul Arrow. Come to think of it, I... Well, whatever. This... This is kind of unnecessary. Whoa. Why is that so loud? Gravity equals pyro now, yeah. Alright, so yeah, we're doing these insane strats, guys. We're gonna respawn Dragon Rider. Uh, yeah, I'll be watching GDQ. Probably later tonight. Alright, we're gonna do that, and then we're gonna come down here. <laughs> All right, solid forty six thousand souls.
Well, it's kind of slow to do this, but it is nice because then you can get a lot of, uh, you can get a lot of upgrades and stuff. Do I have enough health to survive, actually? Five even enough? It's enough. Nope. Hey, Minecrafter, thank you for the 18 months. God dang it. And do the parry glitch. Well, I don't need to do the parry glitch. I can just level up my health. <clears throat> God, my character looks so ugly hollow. Dude, my character looks like horrifying. Yeah, so we're gonna get the we're gonna get the dark pyromancy glove while we're down here. Which is Dark Pyro Oh shit. Standing on the hollow head. I'm gonna get the branch as well. Dude, I don't even know how to get out of here. Oh yeah, it's the slider. I should probably just use the homeward bone. Fine though. I did the skip! I did it, but, oh shit, are my so where are my souls gonna be? Okay, they're over there. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get the tw the 20 gems here. These are pretty good. Yeah, dark fog's not a pirate. Hey Dawson Beer, what's up, buddy?
This area is so much brighter in vanilla, actually. It's kind of interesting. Hey, Rowan. Okay. <laughs> so now that we got the branch, we can go free Rosabeth. I will be doing DLCs, yeah. Alright, so we should have enough souls to buy three fire seeds and then maybe like a spell or two. Am I doing Happy Hubs League? Uh, I was thinking about it, I'm not sure. I'm not really much of a Noha runner, but... Oh god, chat. I don't have... I don't have anything! Get out of my way! Dude, Rosabeth is gonna die if I try to talk to her. Will you let me rest? Basilisk is just gonna... They all just come out. Dude, I... Wait, is she... Oh yeah, she... Okay, wait, wait, hold on. Sorry, I'm so confused. She's outside now. Isn't she? How do I get this to fucking open back up? Can I... Wait, does it not... Oh my god. Alright, whatever, let's just... Dark Souls streamer. Listen, okay, I speedrun the games. I don't fucking talk to Rosabeth. Oh shit, we need to- we should get the blue clear stone ring. Man, this run is gonna take so long.
Okay, she said she's going back to Majula. You better. Getting her to go back to Majula is like one of the hardest things ever, I swear. He does not like going back to Majula. It's pretty simple. No, it's not. All right, chat. 30 fire orbs. Let's go. Not big fire orb. I don't. I don't have great fireball. Man, I really wish that we could customize our character in Dark Souls 2 for the speed run. So nice. Enough for one firebomb. <laughs> Alright, 29 fire orbs. If I can't kill last giant with this, this is like Omega concerning. Our damage should be pretty good though, I think. Not opening the gate. Dude, if I die to last giant, I'll get the hundred subs. Not dying to this guy. God, this damage. Well, it's doing way more than 60, but... Oh wait, I just realized that I should not have used these fire seeds on the Dark Pyro Glove. That was a grave mistake, actually. I mean, it should be okay.
I mean, there's a lot that you can pick up in the game, but... Are there fire seeds in the DLC? it's fine that's pyromancy I used my glove to pull the ballista <laughs> uh, fuck I'm gonna have to pick up so many more fire seeds now though I didn't consider the fact that I I just wanted to use this pyro glove temporarily so I should not have upgraded it. Go forth. Touch the demon inside me. I actually have pyromancies to blow up the barrel though, if it fails. Do I even want to blow up the barrel? I don't think you can infuse pyro gloves. I really fucked up. There's one there. Commit to the hollow flame. Yeah, I really don't want to do that. Hollow flame is so... well... I mean, it's actually decent, but... Honestly, where the heck am I right now? I'm completely lost, chat. Here, wait a sec. Where am I? <laughs> oh, there it is. Listen, this chest is hard to find, okay? Yeah, I just picked up a ring that gives me faster spell casting speed. Dude, I fucked myself over so bad by buying those fire seeds. Dang it. I'm, I'm tempted to just cheat in three fire seeds, honestly. <laughs> just a reset.
Just find some fire seeds. Go ahead. Oh, dumb. Well, yeah, I don't, I don't want to use the dark love as the thing. But maybe it's better if I just use the dark love the whole run. But the thing, like, it's the damage is worse if you're not at, if you're not hollowed. There's 18 of them. I don't think there's 18 in vanilla. That's the problem. There's 15 three are bought from the pyro chick. Yeah, that's the problem. I'm not... There are a bunch of fire seeds that I can get late game, but I'm gonna have to do, like... I'm gonna have to do, like, half the bosses with a plus five pyro flame now. There's one I can get in Rotten. There's one before Chariot up here. But I, I can't get the Giant's Memory ones until I kill Ancient Dragon, which... I'm not going to kill Ancient Dragon for like an hour and a half, or like two hours. Yeah, I mean, I could use Ring of Binding, but then the DLC bosses are going to kill me in almost one hit. And talk to the dragon and kill later. That doesn't really solve the problem, though. I don't even know what boss to do right now. I guess we'll do Flexile. Cheat engine a max level pyro flame. Listen, it's not what I'm trying to do. Carhelion can actually reinforce the pyro flame, funny enough. Yeah, you can kill Rosabeth for one extra fire seed.
Man, fire seeds are kind of depressing in this game. Like, there is really not that many. Is it worth to kill her for one extra? I mean, after you bought everything from her, you don't need her anymore, so you just kill her. Extra fire seed, dude. What a psychopath. <laughs> okay. It's the truth, though. Use scrolls to un. Never. Alright, see you later, Draco. Oh, look at that damage! The stun! What? Man, this boss has quite the quite the move set. You gonna do it again? <laughs> Iromancy, flame, and fire. Oh, wait, why did I use this? One sec, guys. Hmm. 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 Oh. What the heck? They turned into three fire seeds. Wow, that's just what I needed. Perfect. All right. Where do you get the fire clutch ring in this run? Or in this game, actually?
just spawn it in. Guys, okay. Fuck you. Listen, I made one mistake. Forgive me, alright? I don't want this run to take like eight hours. Okay, let's go kill... Who do I want to kill? We should probably kill Rotten. Listen, chat, I'll just I'll just get rid of the dark pyromancy flame. It's like nothing ever happened, alright? Oh, look at that damage. Where do you get great combustion from? Just cheated in. Guys, it's not funny. Great combustion. Oh, it's in Drang Lake? How can I get that before Skeleton Lords? Oh, it's Titchy Gren. Okay, we should we should probably do chariot then. actually want to bone out after Rotten. Well, it's fine, I guess. I guess we should, we should go to the DLC. Yeah, Rotten gives so many souls. <laughs> yeah. Attunement glitch and barely have enough cast. You have to actually do... Like, if you don't use the attunement glitch, you have to be really careful with your routing. Because you can run out of spell cast so easily. You need to use, like, multiple herbs just to kill the bosses. Get the clutch ring from the DLC. It's in the... It's in the Iron King DLC, though, isn't it? Oh, it's in the third DLC. After Ava. Well, that's even more of a pain in the ass, honestly. Oh my gosh, I have so many poppable souls. Uh, fire clutch is kind of insignificant. Oh yeah, the bottom of the Majula well. There is a pyromancy there, I think. You're right.
not using fire arrows. I know. I'm I'm so sorry. Oh shit, I didn't get the cheaper bright bugs. Okay. Alright, int and faith. Twenty twenty five. Then sixteen. Our damage should be pretty good now. I'm this is the path is the path. Yep. The path. And flash sweat. Right. Wait. Plus six. Let's go do chariot. Yeah, I will put the run up on YouTube. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah, we can use yearn. Nice. Yeah, we can do chariot. Okay. Mm. Nice pyromancy. <laughs> How are you supposed to get those lo uh, metal chests on the lava rocks and iron keep without dying? You have to be like really, really patient. Uh, well, not patient. <laughs> you need you need a lot of setup. You can't really do it right away. That's what I found. You need like what? Oh. I'm so happy. Oh my god. I'm pretty sure that's the one I saw before. It was like in like a plastic bag. It's not the one in the box. Oh, okay. There you go. Uh, but yeah, you can use, like, Flash Sweat, plus Fire Resist Armor, and Rings. 30 Vigor and some Life Gems queued up. Yeah, yeah, you can get wet using the urns. So far, my hmm. Nice. Damage, dude. Oh no. Oh my god, he almost just killed me. Settle down, horsey. Cheated damage, dude. Shut the fuck up. Oh my god, I'm never gonna hear the end of this. Alright, let's buy some new spells. Oh god, I need the fucking token. Oh my. Where do you get the to- oh, This guy. You know what, it's fine. Because I think we can go get a spell down there. The cheat engine has the 
Oh no! I thought I had my bow out. So I believe there's a pyromancy. No, it's a fucking miracle. Wait, is there a pyromancy here? I'm, I've been jebated. Is there one in the chest? I don't think so. Hold on, I'm just gonna open up the... I have the wiki page open. We need to go to Strayed. The chest is Ash Knuckle Ring? Okay. No, I am specifically not using FXtra wiki. Using wiki dot. Alright. Uh Yes, let me fucking buy stuff. <laughs> Come. Where do we want to go now? I guess we'll do Skelly Lords. Alright, we have 62 great combustion chat. We are strong. I'm gonna get Forbidden Sun. It takes a while to be able to get Forbidden Sun. Alright, so there is one more... There's one more fire seed I can get after Skelly Lords. Okay. Great combustion is not very fast. Oh! 
Oh, one shot. Oh. Oh wait, I made a mistake. Forgot about these bone wheels. God, that was... I'm sorry, that was insane. <laughs> but... You don't die in one shot. Using that strat in the actual run, trust me, you you do not want to do this strat in the speed run. So we can get one more fire seed up ahead here before Covetous. And we can get one from killing uh, Rosabeth. And I guess we'll also get one in Duke Stone and we can get the Great Fireball spell. How do I plan on killing the giant boss in BS3? Uh, probably with either Boulder Heave... Oh yeah, I got rid of my moss. Nice one. It's in it's in the it's in this room I think. Fire seed, maybe. Yeah, I might get the Lion Mage set. Not sure if I should go do Sentinels. I don't know if I should do Sentinels or Najka first. The spell is honestly, what the hell is going on? The spell is pretty good, but it uses so much endurance. Alright, let's go get some stuff from Melentia. 
we can upgrade a bit more, I guess. So sorry. Why'd you keep one of the fire seeds for yourself? The pump. <laughs> Should have just given it to me. <laughs> Unfollowed trash stream. <laughs> okay, dude. You should have given me the fire seed chat, that's all I'm saying, alright? She brought this upon herself. You have the option to cheat in the seed, but you choose to kill her instead. Yeah, well, listen, I don't want to cheat anymore, all right? I've cheated enough. Oh, yeah? Nice. This respawn her. Listen, you know, she did she did everything she could for me. She got me all my upgrades. She she was she was good, but she had to die. So. Somebody's behind me. Nah. I like this spell, but man, it's stamina usage is brutal. We're gonna go free strayed and we're gonna get a sick pyromancy spell chat. Flame swath. Oh yeah, baby. Can get lingering flame. What is lingering flame from? He he also sells it, right? Is Lingering Flame... Lingering Flame is like the bomb that you put down on the ground, right? Oh yeah, 
there's also... Wait, if I get the best... Oh, uh, shit. There's a fire seed I could get here, but I need the Bastille key. Where the heck do you even get the Bastille key? Let's get the spells Lingering Flame and Flame Schwath. Let's also get some Rouge Water. The Gape Ring. You don't need the Gape Ring. Where's Flame Swath? Flame Swath is legit really good, chat. Oh shit, I warped the wrong bonfire. I should probably do the glitch with, um, the achievement glitch with Flame Swath instead of Great Combustion, but we do have 11 casts, which is still pretty good. Alright, so now we're gonna go work our way towards Great Fireball. And yeah, let's get the Lion Mage set while we're here. Hey, Schopenhauer. Thank you for the Prime sub, buddy. What do you mean a statue box? Oh no, I used it! Oh, I used it on... Fuck, man. I used it on Strayed. I should have came here first. Oh my god, dude. Where can I get another branch? Oh god, I don't remember. Just ch I'm not cheating it in, chat. Dude, I really want to ride Najka. Oh, look at that damage. Come on, Najka, get over here. Give me that butt. He doesn't want to do the butt slam. Come on, Najka, do it. We want to try to kill mini uh, rat authority. I'm gonna have to say no. I think we're probably gonna skip rat authority for now.
Oh man, I really wish I had a... Uh... I wish I had like a Firestorm ability for a Congregation coming up. That's okay though. No, I don't have any Firestorms, I don't think. Oh wait, I do actually have Firestorm. I'll equip it. Yeah, I, I forgot. Titchy Grun actually does sell Firestorm. There's like two or three different types. There's like Chaos, Firestorm, and Tempest, or whatever. I mean, I'll come back for the boss, don't worry. We have 62 firestorms. Wait, what happened to my... What happened to my other spell? Wait, why? Wait, can you not? I thought you... Wait, what the fuck? Why is it not working? Oh, be... But no, it doesn't take two slots. Let's see, will it work? Well, this time it worked. That's it's weird. There's some like maybe it has to do with like the order that you attune it or something. I don't I just love cheating. Can't control it, I'm sorry. Oh, here we go! That was pretty disappointing, actually. The Punch Pyromancy, yes, it's one of my favorite. Okay. So now we're gonna go down to Freya. Oh my god, where am I going? Oh no, don't blow up! I wanted to try to do Seldora skip, but I kind of forgot how to do it.
At least that guy got one shot. Equipping a torch doesn't actually work in this version of the game, funny enough. One spot. Oh, yeah. Oh my god, this hitbox. Yeah, now I can get the Lion Mage set, that's true. Alright. Alright, buddy. Alright, buddy. Dude! Will you fuck off, man? Thirty thirty seems good. Right. Yep, we're gonna go get great fireball now. Dora scoop. Thought I could close the door. <laughs> BKGS is actually in this chest, too. <laughs> Alright, now we can get plus nine. Let's also go get the... Uh, we're gonna get the Lion Mage set. These guys weak to fire at all? I don't think they are. These guys aren't weak to shit.
Oh my god. Here they come. Let's go do mini rats and then we can get toxic mist, I guess. So should upgrade the flame one more time. I only need one more fire seed. Not sure where I should get the final one. There is one in Sinner's Rise, but I don't I don't really know where to get it. No soul appease, but it gets the job done. Let's get plus nine. Oh. Plus one eighty four, that's pretty good. All right, uh, let's go to Strayed Cell. And then we can go do center, I guess. Not really sure. Dude, Strade's placement is so weird, like <laughs> Why is he just standing next to a million enemies? Yeah, the Lion Mage set reduces cat speed. What are you aiming at, dude?
think... I think there, there's also some armor that increases pyromancy damage. I think I think Sinner's armor increases pyro damage, but we're not going to be able to get Sinner's armor because Malin's dead. I don't think it's that much anyways. Let's get a little bit more attunement. My agility is fine. All right, let's go do... I guess we can go do Mitha, actually. Hey, Rockhill, thank you for the Prime sub, man. Why using Flame Swath? Because it's actually one of the best Pyromancy spells. Believe it or not, quite good. What? What? 147. Use Outcry? I kind of want to get Outcry, but it's so slow to get. Myth, uh, with the poison up. <laughs> no chance. Damage, baby. Oh, I shouldn't have done this. This is Dark Souls 2 where it doesn't count as well. <laughs> My name is toilet bitch. You wanna go, bitch? Get over here. <laughs> oh. 
I wish I had like I don't even know what other rings to get. To be honest. Yeah, like fire clutch would be good. Let's uh let's get rid of Bustion. We need to put on poison mist. We are going to Poison and Toxic, Smelter and Iron King. It's actually pretty good for them. No, 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 no! Also, Tension's right. Thank you for the Prime sub. And Raquel, thank you for the Prime as well. Alright, you know what? Let's, uh, let's buy... I don't even know what I'm buying. I kind of just wanted the carvings. Look at how much damage this shit does, actually, though. It's pretty good, right? Bartomancer, <laughs> yeah.
not a pyro. Okay. Yeah, you're right. I'm sorry. This run as legit as F extras. I gotta make sure to buy these extra bright bugs coming up. We still need to get one more fire seed. Not really sure where to get it. Could probably get it in the area after smelter. I'm trying to think, are there any other like important Pyro spells that I want to get. Well, obviously Forbidden Sun, we want to get that. Is there anything other than like Forbidden Sun? Outcry, I have to, if I want to get Outcry, I have to get, I have to freaking remove all of the smelter thingies. I don't even know where to get all the wedges from. Hey, Lynch, thank you for the 22 months. All right, come on. No baby jump, please. I don't have baby jump mod installed on this version of the game, so...
bitch. No, it's not on Nexus mods. Alright, let's go back. Real quick. Yeah, baby jumps are in both versions of the game. If you want to learn, if you want to learn about what baby jumps are and like why they happen, you can type exclamation mark baby jumps. Yeah, I forgot my cam was off. My bad. Flying Coconut, thank you for the 25 months. And Lynch, thank you for the 22. But Kopchi, thank you for the 14. Thank you for the gift sub, Dorian. No, I don't have any sub goal. I just since I, I did a I did a trilogy run on YouTube with miracles, so I figured I'd do pyros. I'll probably do sorceries as well before Elden Ring comes out. Alright, uh let's see, where do I want to go now? I've killed Sinner, I've killed Freya. Have I killed all of the Lord Souls? Iron King, Rotten? Yeah I have. Okay. Nice, we can go to Drang Lake then. I still have to kill gargoyles, yeah, but... I mean, I could kill gargs right now. It's not gonna bother, though. If there was no baby jump mod, the record for Dark Souls 2 would probably still be like a 210 or something. The record would be so much worse for Dark Souls 2. Yeah, I also have to kill Giant Rat. I 
I'm not gonna do few I'm not gonna do DLC two until I get like Forbidden Sun. That should be my next goal right now. We'll just we'll do Drang Lake Castle and Bellstadt and then we'll go get Forbidden Sun, I guess. Yeah, so for, for those who are too lazy to read but are curious what baby jumps are, basically in this game, so the way that jumping in this game works, and I, this isn't like exactly correct in terms of like the numbers, but so let's say when you're sprinting in this game, okay, you run it, let's say 3.5 like units per second. Now, the problem is, for some reason, the way that jumping in this game works is that so when you jump the game checks to see if your speed is above like 3.5 okay and when you're running you're always above 3.5 but the issue is that for some reason there's two different movement speed values in dark souls 2 so there's a clean stable one that doesn't move at all and then there's another movement speed value, which is the one that they use for the jumping. And that value is tied to your CPU usage. So, basically, if you have a very stressed out CPU and you're at high CPU usage, your movement speed will randomly fluctuate between like 3.4 and 3.6. Now, the funny thing is, your character isn't like that, that, that speed, you're running... That's not, you're not actually running slower sometimes. It's just that value, for some reason, they use like an inconsistent value for it. Oh god. Oh, this is not good. Why would they use a second value? That's the million dollar question, man. No, no. It's just, it makes no sense because they have. Basically, what the baby jump mod does is that it uses the. It doesn't even add any, like, code to the game. It just changes the jumping function to use the clean, stable movement speed value rather than the, the noisy one that's affected by CPU usage. Basically. If that makes sense. And she still gets some baby jumps on the mod. Well, those there are some spots where baby jumps can still happen, but 
It happens because the terrain is weird. There's like some weird terrains in some spots in the game where your character, like if you run over a certain ledge or something, it can slow your character down slightly. Or if you're at the end or start of your sprint, yeah. Yeah, you don't you don't reach full speed instantly. I haven't even used Great Fireball yet. I really should. They really should try it. Pyro is not broken in Dark Souls 2, though. I'm just, I'm sorry to say it's not. <laughs> This is the only part about vanilla that I do not look forward to. There's just way less enemies in vanilla in general. I need to make sure to attune Great Fireball after this. Why you need to run naked instead of where... I don't know what you're asking. Are you asking me why I'm not running naked, or what What do you mean? Your stamina regen is a bit worse if you have armor on, but... This is like a meme run, so it doesn't really matter. Great fireball.
Let's grab. Let's grab these. I really want to get some better rings, but. I know. I want to try to get the better. Uh, I want to get the like chaos storm. Oh yeah, I need to. Oh my god, this damage is really bad. Where is the fire clutch lich? He's probably going to do the shield thing now. No? I don't really want to... It's not really worth aestheticing Skeleton Lords. In my opinion. Yeah, Pyromancies are pretty weak against Mirror Knight. Alright, let's go back and actually upgrade to plus 10. I've been neglecting that. near the night after the bonfire from the Eye of the Priestess. Oh, okay. The one that you have to, like, open the gate for. Well, I think you have to open a gate for all of them, but... The Paul... You think we can go get the Chaos Storm spell? You think I can survive? And I have Flash Sweat, the Fire Ring. I also have the Orange Burrs. Sweat and Burr don't stack. Oh. Thank you. 
Jesus, dude. Oh yeah, and you should get the water. There's toilet bitch. Yeah, I could jump on the rocks from above. All right, hold on. Let me. I'll get the water, and then we'll. We'll be fine. I gotta pull the lever, don't I? To get the water pots. <laughs> yeah, that water is strong, dude. Alright, what boss do we want to go do now? I guess we could try Rat Authority. Yeah, I, I was surprised. When I fell onto that ledge and I had like 5% health, I thought I was dead for sure. Oh shit. some of my spells here. A bit messed up. Hey, Shmoop, thank you for the 17 months. work there we go spell attunement glitches kind of a mess okay chat I'm gonna I'm gonna hit them and then use fire chaos storm and hopefully they all die
that spell did not do as much as I was hoping for. I hate this fucking attack. Let's just spam him with Chaos Storm. It's honestly pretty good. I just hate- I hate the fact that it only does full damage like one time. Back to a mana. I just can't wait to get Forbidden Sun. Yeah, Demon's Firestorm is insane. Demon's Firestorm can hit like 10 times in a row. <laughs> I remember I used the I, I used Firestorm on a boss and it did like fifteen thousand damage or something. But I'm trying to think, is there anything else I'd want to get? I could pick up the life ring actually. Might be kinda nice for safety. I don't really know where else... I don't really know what other rings to use, so I might as well get something that's gonna help. Life ring's not there, it's further up. Dude, I can't even fucking move! leveled up my ADP a bit more, I think. Just dodge. Yeah, I tried. I tried, but he, he's too strong.
I'm getting that damn life ring. I don't care at this point. Uh, I'm at 95 agility, which is actually pretty good. I have, I have pretty decent iframes, but you can barely roll in the water here is the problem. Why do all the branches have to respawn? <laughs> Alright, it's fine. We're gonna... We're gonna destroy the branches with our great fireball. Come here, asshole. Woo! Yeah, give me that extra health. Just pyro only game yeah i mean doing any sort of magic only run in dark souls 2 is kind of like suffering i'm not gonna lie at least compared to like compared to melee hexes are okay falling hexes busted is a bit of a stretch but hexes are decent they're definitely not op though Chaos Storm can even hit him, chat. So many of these casts are just missing.
Oh no, I have not forgotten Taka. But we do have the attunement glitch now. Which is gonna make it like way more manageable. But yeah, I have not forgotten. Are there any other pyros that we'd want to get? I don't really think there's much else. I mean, there's Outcry, I guess. Yeah, at this point, we mainly just want to get Forbidden Sun. Pyro only in DS3 is pretty good, but... You need to use Boulder Heave. Boulder Heave is quite important. Why Boulder Heave? Well, Boulder Heave does physical damage and it uses very low FP. The low FP is like... the main thing that's really good. Alright, got some more effigies. You can basically kill every boss in the game with Boulder Heave. There isn't any boss that's like resistant to physical. Boulder Heave is like the best pyromancy spell, but Great Chaos Fireball is actually pretty good too. And yeah, there's there's some other good spells, but the the main the main issue with Pyro is that like you don't have enough. For some of the DLC bosses, it's really hard to kill all of them uh, without running out of mana. I remember, I tried doing Demon Princes with Dark Pyromancy, and it's it's doable, but you need like 10 Ashenestas. Yeah, let's try chaos.
Are you supposed to beat the bosses without the achievement glitch very, very carefully? You need a lot of spell restore items. So I, I did do a pyromancy only run. I, I don't know if I ever highlighted it or put it on my YouTube. I think I'm... Maybe I did, but... But yeah, it it's it's really rough. All right, chat. Now it's time for Navlon's quest. Oh wait, I need to die in order to do Navlon's quest. I need to be hollow. How, how much of his quest do I have to do to get Forbidden Sun? <laughs> How many bosses are left? Quite a few. Oh yeah, there's a fire seed here as well. Not that I need it anymore. You can collect all the armor and stuff before you actually kill, uh, before you talk to him, right? Pretty sure you can. Alright, see you later, Mr. Understood. Have a good one, buddy. Probably should have went and done that before I went to go do Guardian Dragon, but that's okay. Hey, Abyss. Easy punch. Oh, 
fire punch counts as pyro. I mean, guys, this isn't like an official. <laughs> this isn't. This is just a meme run, but yeah, but it, it counts. Mm -hmm. Let's go back to Majula. And we'll go get the ring. Wait. Okay, yeah. We need to get the ladder miniature from Laddersmith Gilligan. Find Mr. Kale. Yeah, I'm doing the Noblon quest for Forbidden Sun. AKA the only spell that I'll use after this point. <laughs> Alright, chat. Pretty cool skip coming up here. Hopefully I don't mess it up. Oh shit. <sighs> yeah, I know. I'm sorry. I had to kill him, chat. I'm sorry. Hexer's Hood. Alright. No, we don't have to do the Herald. The hood gives me one extra spell cast, and I think some infant faith. Or maybe it's just the spell cast, actually. <laughs> oh man, look at this fucking item. I wonder what that was that I dropped. So yeah, the the way that the map is so The way the map works in this game is like super weird. Aldia is actually in the- Aldia's keep is in the same spot as, um... As, like, Najka's area. second. I actually kind of want to buy something from from Navlon. Could have gotten Unleashed Magic. I don't really want to use Unleashed Magic. I don't even think it works. I don't even know if it works for Pyromancies, but well, I guess I, I guess I can just give him the Aged Feather. Why not? You need like 60 in to use Unleash Magic, though, I think.
the main issue is the it's 58 int. Uses three attunement slots? Oh my goodness. Oh yeah, we need mist for Ancient Dragon. God, this glitch is so... Whatever, I have a lot of spell restores, I guess. 66 Forbidden Suns, dude. I'm a wizard. Hey, Tommy, thank you so much for the 51 months. <laughs> Imagine having almost unlimited cast from a glitch and stuff. I mean, it's just... Having to do one spell at a time can be kind of... What does this set give? The Astrologist set? I have no idea. <laughs> God, my fucking character. <laughs> I guess we'll use one bright bug here. Why are there no knights? Because this version doesn't suck.
really should have done the attunement glitch on poison mist and toxic mist. Is he not toxic? God, this fight is so good. What a fight. <laughs> I definitely should have done the attunement glitch, but...
young pupil? Yeah, I'll wait for a fume night. Let's go do Giant Lord. Yeah, I killed Sinner. Here we go. How, like, this is the strongest pyromancy spell in the game, and it still takes like five times longer to kill Giant Lord than with the rapier. <laughs> uh, all right. By the way, this spell, Forbidden Sun, you're only supposed to, you get, what is it, three casts total? And that's if you have 99 attunement. Right now, I would only get one cast of this spell. One cast. <laughs> Put on the astrology stuff. This set is sick, dude. We have a ton of health, so should be fine. Just killed me in the convergence mod. Oh, God. Hey, Yorha Lucifer. Thank you for the 35 months, buddy. Thank you, thank you. So, on a scale from 1 to 10, how excited are you guys for the Fume Knight fight? It's 
gonna be so epic. That ghost. <laughs> Toilet bitch. See, we're making decent pace though. I, I feel like this run will be around four hours. Then again, I don't know, the DLCs might take a while. When do I expect this to be on YouTube? Uh, I probably, it's gonna take a little while to upload and go like high quality, so probably won't be up on YouTube until tomorrow or the day after. Uh, Horse Valley isn't too concerning. Still no fire clutch ring. I just didn't even bother. How much damage does the fire clutch give? Anyways. I don't think it's that much. Where, where is the fire clutch again? It's, it's after, uh... After deal somewhere in DLC three. Is it DLC two? People were saying it was DLC three. Damage is pretty good, actually. Yeah, there, there's a glitch which allows you to have, like, basically 99 casts of any spell. So yeah, I'm sorry, I'm cheating for this run. Forgive me. I've sinned.
fireball versus fireball. Slowly whittling him down. Dude, Forbidden Sun actually has really far range. I wonder if you could do that one glitch that I was trying with Forbidden Sun in like the first DLC or whatever. This spell actually goes so far. What? I'm toxic. should have made it so Sin can't do multiple flying attacks in a row. more bright bugs. I think I'm going to go for 105 agility. Let's go do... Squad, I guess. <clears throat> the whole reason that I'm saving up so many bright bugs is for the DLC fights mainly. The DLC fights are freaking scary, dude. Oh yeah, I still have to do gargs. Yeah. Thanks for reminding me. Maybe I should go get... Okay, hold on. I need to... I'm gonna look this up. I 
I can't get the the penal handcuffs. Mullen's dead. He's fucking dead, dude. Oh. Gotta kill this guy. Alright, asshole. You can resurrect Malin, but his stock doesn't update. His stock is basically stuck to when you, whenever you killed him. And I killed Malin pretty early. Also, his name's not Maldrin, it's Malin. bright bugs that's probably a bit much they're safe than sorry I think I'm gonna use the bright bug in the fight Maybe I'll do the cheese. Can I do the cheese strap? <laughs> that was pretty good. A little cheesy, but uh, you know, do what you gotta do. Swap would have actually probably been better there. 
still no outcry dude outcry would literally take me like 20 minutes to get i just i don't want to bother Yeah, I'm gonna put this run on YouTube. Yes, sir. Is Outcry better than Chaos Storm? I actually don't know. Yeah, we're gonna have to free some of the knights for this run. It's just gonna be terrible if we don't. I'll, I'll probably free two knights, I think. Outcry is the best AoE ability, but it's only two casts and 99 attunements. Let's see. It's crazy how big this DLC actually is. In the, in the speed run, you barely do. Like, <laughs> you barely even go into the DLC. Sorcery dog shit in DS2. I mean, it's okay. It's not great, though. the habit of chewing my hair. Sometimes my hair gets my mouth, but definitely not on purpose. killed fume yet i'm way i'm doing fume at like the very end when i'm really op i'd like to get one more ring but i don't i don't even know what to use something that gave a something that would give like a bit more health would probably be nice Zava might have actually been doable. I mean, it would have been kind of fucked, but... Oh! 
Holy shit, I did not think that was gonna happen. Invisible Ava before Giant Lord. Giant, last Giant, oh god. We gotta get rid of the fire. Get rid of the ice. I did not, Kemi. So many poppable souls. Shit. Oh, we can we can get the fire clutch ring finally now, guys. There's flame butterflies there. Breath of the Wild was number one. <laughs> okay. How much fucking health does this guy have, man? He's just... He's gonna interrupt me again, isn't he? Okay. Big damage now, chat. Let's get a little bit more health. Let's get 105 agility. Fifty bigger. I just want a lot of health for Fume Knight mainly. <laughs> yeah, well the Fume Knight is gonna take fucking forever, so if I die, it's just like it's really, really bad. Uh, 
Alright, we gotta go free the one other knight. I think we wanna go this way. I'm excited to do DS3 though, I gotta say. Hey, Nexus Wolf. One oh five agility is like excessive amounts of iframes. I think at one oh five you get like I don't know, some you get like fourteen or fifteen iframes or something. I don't know. It's, you get a lot. Like Thirteen, maybe. Yeah, I saw Joel Haver do the DS3 speedrun. Equal to DS1. I think you get even more iframes than DS1. This part is kind of scary. Not stand over there, please. Oh, uh, this game is fucking cancer, dude. I can't fucking do it. I can't open the door. And I can't cast. Oh, my. come over here, you fucking bitch. Oh my god, now the other enemy is resetting. Oh god, please. Kill them? Yeah, just kill them, forehead. Only takes like 80 casts. Here we go. Damage isn't too bad. At least it staggers.
that everybody? Uh, dude, you've got a portal to freeze. He's not gonna freeze it in time. I don't even know what he's doing. Bro, you have- go do your job, man. What the fuck is he doing? What are you doing? Are you going into the portal that's already fucking... Okay. Yo, am I gonna get the AI freeze here? Oh my god, no. Or not the AI freeze, I thought I, thought I might get the glitch. If Ivory King is standing on top of that knight when the when the ice spawns, he can die in one hit, actually. It's pretty nice. Stagger. How do you, how do you get the Ring of Transfusion and the Hollow Overhaul mod? Dude, I don't even know what that ring is. I can't remember. I only played that mod once for like a little bit, so. I mean, a certain amount of ADP is fine. Like 95 agility is good, but base ADP in this game is actually fucked up. Like, there's some boss attacks that are so fast that you, you actually just can't... Uh, there's nothing you can do. You can't counter... You, you can't iframe their attacks for long enough. I mean, the hitboxes aren't crap. The, the, like, the problem with adaptability is that, so like, if you design the game around people playing it with base adaptability, then if they do level up their adaptability, the game will become extremely easy. Because base adaptability, you have like six iframes. So if they if they made every attack only hat like only stay active for a few frames, then this game would be extremely easy. There isn't really any, like, there isn't really any solution, except for just not having adaptability in the first place. I did my first playthrough with, like, three adapt- with base adaptability, and it was- it was terrible.
Dude, get away from me, man. Fuck. Shit, I don't think I had Fire Clutch on for that last fight. Pursuer on your first playthrough. Yeah, I'm trying to remember what boss was like the most frustrating for me with the low ADP. Yeah, well, Explorer is the is Explorer actually starts with good adaptability from the beginning, which is nice. Explorer starts with nine iframes. Bandit, for example, starts with five or six. Yeah, uh, the cats are really annoying on low ADP for sure. Oh yeah, I still gotta do the gargs. Let's go do the gargs after double cats, I guess. We're, uh, we're making pretty good progress though. We've got what, gargs and then all of the second DLC. Second deal, I mean we already got the scepter in the second DLC at least. I maybe should have summoned actually. I do have a ton of health though. So it's Oh yeah, Dark Lurker. Oh god, I forgot about Dark Lurker. Yeah, Dark Lurker's gonna be fucking annoying. Also, I'm surprised I got a... I got a horse spawn already. Let's see, how much? I feel like I missed the building. I try to speedrun with zero ADP. Uh, no. Sounds horrible. Yeah, you can beat the game with 3 ADP. For sure.
Yeah, you can strafe a lot of stuff, but some sometimes bosses put you in situations where you have no choice but to roll. Man, double cats give like no souls. It's actually kind of fucked up. Oh yeah, let's go do uh let's go do gargs before I forget. Actually. Because they're so easy, yeah. What? Oh my god, I don't have a... I could have grabbed the stone from Rotten. I, for I just forgot that I don't get one. Imagine there was a way to just, like, jump over the ledge here. Oh, that would be pogged. I would have poked. I haven't killed the giants yet.
<laughs> New speedrun strat, yeah. Let's just, we'll do two of the Dark Lurker dungeons right now. Hey, Dead Ringer, thank you for the 19 months. But yeah, so this is the armor piece. You know that armor piece that we saw in Aldia's Keep? This is the armor piece right there. Like, Aldia's Keep is... <laughs> it's like in the same area as this spot. DS3, all the magic in, in DS3 is really good, to be honest. Hey, Monte, thank you for the four months. Forbidden Sun for this dungeon is quite nice. <laughs> Damn, it's a free shot. Pretty good. I think magic will be good in Elden Ring, yeah. I don't know if it's gonna be better than melee though. FromSoft just seems like they've gotten a lot better at ba like balance, honestly. Oh god, I also have to do Vendrick. Oh fuck me. never ends. guy is quite tanky. I have unlimited Forbidden Suns too, bitch. I 
Do I have 50 suns? Because I'm cheating. Oh. Uh, I'm cheating legally. <laughs> Legal cheats. Yeah, he had the he had like magic protection active from the the mage, I think. Why well, I was taking so many damn hits to kill him. Yeah, you can see the damage is pretty decent now. Damn you. Killed Navlon many times. No, there's a thing called an attunement glitch in this game. You can look it up on YouTube if you want to know what, what I'm talking about. But, alright, we're going to go get... We're gonna get an extra, an extra giant soul, I think. I'm not sure which one is faster to get, like the. The other one is faster to get, but you have to run further to get to the tree, so... Yeah, Dark Lurker is weak to fire damage, so he's gonna get wrecked. Dark Lurker will be the one fight that's actually, like, relatively fast. <laughs> Although I think he's he's weaker to lightning than he is to fire, but... Okay, then. Okay, then. Normally this guy does not go through the wall instantly like that, but normally it's like on a delay. Alright, please no wombo combo here. This should be fine, having four, I think. Five would be nice, but... I think it's unnecessary. Should be pretty good damage. magic would be a lot better in this game if there was actually rings that boosted your magic damage. It's kind of weird when you think about it that there's there's pretty much like no rings that boost your magic damage in this game for the most part except the clutch rings. In Dark Souls 3 you can get like there's like four there's like four rings you can get to increase your damage. damage this flame swap do it's pretty good and 
let's see. <laughs> The 17 is like the burn damage from the spell on the ground. Alright guys, Fume Knight is coming up soon. done Dark Lurker. I'll do Dark Lurker before Throne Duo, because it's in the same, same area. Can you Toxic Fume Knight? I don't think you can. Toxic or poison him. He's immune to poison out there. Thought so. Would increasing int increase damage? Uh, yeah. I mean, I have 30-30, which is, like, pretty close to the max you're gonna get. Maybe I could get a little bit more. I, I could maybe do one level up after Smelter. Attack is so slow. Luckily, this smelter is. This is a magic smelter, actually. Bright bug, actually. Stunned him.
Alright. Hey, subpar sound. Thank you for the 15 months. Thank you very much. Alright, we'll go level up our stats a little bit more. Maybe that'll help. I don't really know. Fire bonus is plus 191. I got seven damage. Sick. Alright guys, here we go. Prepare for and Hopefully this won't be as bad as I remember. Yeah, so we need to get we need to get the bot. I'm gonna grab the bonfire, and I need to get rid of all the statues. Westy. Mm. Mm. Oh. I have spell restore items, so like the, one of these crimson waters will probably restore my. It'll probably restore like twenty or thirty casts. So I have like what twenty spell restore items right now. Sharon. I actually like really got to go to the bathroom chat, so I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go peepo run to the bathroom real quick. I was gonna wait till the end of the run, but I. I gotta go, dude. We're right back.
Okay. Here we go, guys. damage is much better than the last time I did this. It's still not good, but it's it's not going to take that long. God, the clutch stagger. Oh my god, these staggers? Easy frickin' clap. Hey, D-Pod, thank you for the nine months. Yeah, well, the funny thing is... So, I have, I have done pyromancy only in this game one other time. This is... This is the second run I've ever done of Pyro only, and the first time I did this, there was no attunement glitch, so 
The fight took me like 30 minutes and I had to use like 10 spell restore items or something. It was it was fucked up. I was using like fireball and normal combustion doing like 10 damage. It was funny to watch, yeah. Like trying to do magic only runs without the attunement glitch is actually so rough. Especially in the early game and for some of the DLC bosses. I actually don't think I killed old Dragon Slayer. I think you're right. I think I still need to kill him. Yeah, Dark Souls 2 just goes on and on. But we're almost done. We are on, like, the home stretch right now. Yeah, magic only in Dark Souls 3 is a lot of fun, but can't say the same about Dark Souls 2. Can't fucking s can't fucking see after I hit him. Was a little a little sketchy at the end that's all right okay let's go kill ornstein we, yeah i'm pretty sure we actually didn't kill him oh, i went to the wrong bonfire <clears throat> am i wearing makeup i don't think so unless larks have put some on me last night <laughs> He's gonna be NG plus, no. NG plus, you get NG plus Dragon Slayer by, I think, Bonfire Aestheticking the Dragon Rider Bonfire.
I wish I could use... I mean, I could use other pyro spells. But man, fires... Uh, Forbidden Sun is just so good. I'm like so OP for this guy right now. Hit him with the Chaos Storm. The Chaos Storm would be so good if it could hit multiple times. Alright, chat. All we've got left is Dark Lurker and the final bosses. It's happening. I'm excited to do DS3. DS3 will be quite fast. Probably only like two hours. A bit over two hours, I think. I will say Forbidden Sun is quite nice for these dungeons. Weird that... Forbidden Sun casts. Like when you free aim it. It uh it kind of spawns like to the left. Sekiro Pyro only. <laughs> I don't know about that. I don't think you can do flame vent only. We have infinite spirit emblems. I mean, you can kind of do pyro only in Bloodborne if you use the flame sprayer, I guess. But you gotta. I mean, you can kill gas going with. Uh, you can kill gas going with Molotovs. Welcome home, my children. <laughs> you can do Bloodborne Old Patch Molotov only with no mods with the dupe glitch. That's true. It would probably be pretty fucking annoying, but that is true. Yeah, Dark Lurker is super weak to fire. So, uh, Dishin, thank you for the Prime sub. Aldia with fire. I don't think he's that fire resistant. Surprisingly, even though he's on fire, which doesn't really make any sense. I don't know. Hey, Mr. Haddington, thank you for the five months. How many spells does this restore? A lot. <laughs> <laughs> 
Chaos Storm would genuinely be really good if it could hit multiple times. The second hits only do... They barely do, like, anything. Let's see, how much does... Flameswath actually does about the same amount as Forbidden Sun. It's a bit slower. See, like, he's on fire, but look, it still does. Like, it still does a decent amount, especially because he's on fire right now. He already has, like, damage resist. Come on, Aldia, do an attack that doesn't suck, please. Oh god, he's doing the super attack. This attack has, like, a 10, 10 hour charge up. <laughs> boss is so bad you know I it's funny because I was like I remember when when they released scholar of the first sin whoa those attacks were doing more damage was I getting double hits there or something um, anyways I remember they released a patch for vanilla that's and people are like yo there's a new boss that they added at the end of the game and I was so hyped. And then, because Nishandra kind of sucks. And I was like, man, maybe there's going to be a really good, like, final boss for DS2. And then it's this. I was like, man. <laughs> it made it even worse. <laughs> and Aldia kill he kills runs in all bosses. Because if he does the bad attack... You lose so much time. All right, we did it, guys. This run took forever. Am I going to use the spells other than Boulder Heave? I will use stuff other than Boulder Heave, but I will get Boulder Heave. Maybe I'll get the Dark Pyros, but... They're not really, like, worth going for, because Carla is really slow to get, but... I might do it anyways, we'll see. Four hours thirty for DS2, yep. And he has proceeded insatiably. Alright guys, Dark Souls 3, let's go. Elton Ring Pyro run after DS3. I was thinking about adding an incentive to this marathon to do like Pyro only and Demon Souls, even though it's not Pyromancies. But I don't, I don't want to stream too late today, anyways. So. It's fine. I feel like the game sound is a little quiet. Hopefully that should be better. Uh, all right. 
I'm going to let the intro cinematic play. I'm going to take a short break. Uh, yes, indeed. I'll give another shout out to Razor, guys, who's uh, sponsoring the stream. Uh, Razor sponsored me for their new chair, the Razor Isker, which I'm currently sitting in. So if any of you want to check it out, you can type exclamation mark Razor, or you can uh, click the panel below the stream. But yeah, I'll be right back, guys. Pilgrims discover the truth of the old words. The fire fades, and the lords go without thrones. Undead Legion, the Abyss Watchers. And the reclusive Lord of the Profaned Capital. Yom the Giant. Kindled will rise. Nameless, accursed, undead, unfit even to be cinder. And so it is that ash. All right, I'm back. Just in time. All right, chat, you know the drill. First person to prime sub gets the character named after them. Better be fast. People run. Dang, dude, he was ready. He had it locked and loaded. <laughs> hey, Blaine, thank you for the three months. It was actually really fast. <laughs> Alright. Uh, we'll start with Black Firebomb. I've had, like, monstrosities in DS3. I haven't really bothered, and I don't... I don't really want to make a crazy character right now. Okay. Let's do this. <clears throat> I don't know if you can... There you go. <laughs> All right. 
DS3 Pyros are honestly really fun. I kind of consider Dark Souls 2 to be a bit of a drag when it comes to doing these kind of these kind of runs, but there are some fun meme weapons in DS2 with like good damage output, like the warp sword and the craftsman hammer, but man. Doing magic in Dark Souls 2 is brutal. Even when I did hexes, that was pretty rough. But to be fair, when I did I did a hex run, I did Scholar, and that made it like way worse. Uh, no, I'm not doing fire weapon. I'm gonna use the demon scar. Probably not. It's prop. It's just gonna be like all magic. Why is scholar worse? There's just some really annoying parts in scholar. First boss and it's already better than every DS2 boss. Dark Souls 3 just feels a lot feel feels a lot smoother, I'd say that much. Do I have to get the pyromancy scrolls? I can't even remember, dude. I can't remember which, which one is the Great Fireball. Wait, do I, though? I mean, I know I need to get the one for Great Chaos Fireball. I think he, he sells Great Fireball by default. I believe. Alright, so we're gonna come up here. Typical, typical magic run strat. Just come up here and grab the Estus Shard. And we'll also trade a normal firebomb and a black firebomb for a chunk and a large shard. We'll get the silver serpent ring. Pretty sure bitch. I'm pretty sure I have enough fireballs with just one Ash and Estes to kill Vort. Hey Frankie, thank you so much for the six months. Fire orb is from the Great Swamp one. I, gu I guess I can grab the one in the swamp. I, I really don't. I don't know if I need it, but. I get through, please. The Nam de Soul, thank you for the prime sub, and Frankie, thank you for the six. I'm not sure if I want to try to grab the Ashen or the Esther Shard in in the cell. Whatever you want to call it. It's a shitty room. I 
I guess we'll try. I don't know. This Estus shard is... Like, for a magic run, you do want a lot of Estus. So I should probably grab it. Especially if I'm going to use Dark Pyros. Change the game on Twitch. Uh, Mod can do that for me, I guess. I like Dark Souls too. I'm not going to act like it doesn't have a lot of problems. But Dark Souls 2 is still enjoyable. But so, I think the thing that annoys me the most about DS2 is just how... Some, some weapons and builds are just so bad in that game. Like... Dark, Dark Souls 3 has way more balance, I feel. Okay, don't don't die to board. Oh god. <laughs> I should have just locked on. <laughs> No, I was aiming for his head. Hey, Jin Smelt. Yeah, you can do that with like any weapon. If you uh if you hit Vort in the head when he is charging up his frost breath. You can, uh, you'll get, like, huge, you'll get a huge weak spot hit, and then you can also repost him, which does a shit ton of damage. Like, you, you can pretty much kill him every time when he does the frost breath with almost, like, any weapon. I'm through. I'm gonna die here. I recommend the two most popular mods for DS3. Uh, I don't know what those are. I assume it's probably Cinders and something else. Uh, my best... I, I would say Convergence mod is really good. And po uh, Pocket Souls. A lot of people probably haven't played Pocket Souls, but I would, I would highly recommend it. I might actually do another playthrough of that before Elden Ring comes out. It's actually a lot of fun. You, it's basically Pokemon in Dark Souls 3. Uh, it's a mod where you get these Estus flasks that you can throw. Or they're basically like Pokeballs that you could throw at enemies. And you have like a chance to catch them. And if you catch the enemy, then you can summon it. And 
pretty much like that's how you have to play the mod. Like you just run around with all your summons and stuff. Uh, I need to go free. Whatever this guy's name is, Corn Effects or something. It's like an Elden Ring, it kind of is, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna play God of War when it's out on PC. I think so, yeah. Yeah, I have my full playthrough of it up on YouTube in case anybody wants to check it out. For the Pocket Souls. I also have my Convergence mod playthrough up, I believe. Yeah, dude, the new God of War is gonna be so sick. I'm like, I'm so, I'm so excited for that. It's gonna be really cool to see Elden Ring mods as well. Thank God it's on PC. I have a feeling there's gonna be some really cool stuff for Elden Ring. It's probably gonna take a while, but with a bit of time, there's gonna be some really cool mods. Modding has come a long way. Am I still planning on putting Eternal Darkness on YouTube? I don't know if I even highlighted my playthrough of that. Uh, I kind of want to make... Like a VOD, a VOD channel or something. Because I don't, I don't really like just uploading... Uh, like random horror game playthroughs and stuff. I'm kind of try- I'm trying to... I'm trying to like grow my YouTube and I feel like posting a bunch of bods is not not the greatest idea, so I might I might make it like a a new YouTube channel just for for playthroughs. I'm not going to be doing much play like many playthroughs though for a while since Elden Ring's coming out soon. Yeah, the YouTube algorithm is just like Kind of a piece of shit. If your videos don't do well... Like, if you have a video that gets a ton of views, and then you start posting stuff that has less, then YouTube will kind of, like, not recommend you as much. Hey, Izzy, thank you for the 26 months. I'm so, I'm so freaking excited for Elden Ring, dude. Like, oh my god, man. I have I have not been more excited for a game in my entire life, I, and I've been excited for a lot of games before. Like before I started streaming, I remember being so hyped for certain releases. I I mean I used to be like addicted to WoW, being hyped for WoW expansions. <laughs> The new Halo game. Every stream I say that at least five times. It's the truth, man. I'm sorry. I, I can't help myself, dude. Classic or the days, yeah. You're farming proof of Concord with 300 item discovery, yeah. Concord. I've never done all achievements in Dark Souls 3, actually, because it's it's just horrible. Frost bolt spam. <laughs> all time favorite game. I don't know. That's close. Is it faster to quit out instead of opening the door? Uh, depends. Oh, oh, where am I going? Depends where you're talking about. I mean, for for RTA, which is basically what I'm doing, it doesn't really matter. 
Uh, it's generally faster not to put out. I quit out on the door before the elevator just because because it's a little uh, little scary with those enemies chasing you. Okay, I'm a little scared to like try to get past these guys. Okay, well they're <laughs> they're AFK, I guess. Yeah, Hollow Knight is definitely one of my favorite games. these guys. You get a pyro ring when you kill the crabs? Yes, you do. But I already started as a pyromancer, so... Do I like Cuphead? I do, yeah. I'm excited for the DLC for Cuphead. Yeah. I think that... I think that Team Cherry just... I mean, Hollow Knight... I feel like they have they set the bar really high with Hollow Knight and they don't want to like let people down with Silk Song so they're really taking their time with it. They just don't communicate ever. That is true. I hate the sounds that this enemy makes, dude. <laughs> the fuck away from me. Hey, Clay, thank you so much for the four-year resub. Thank you, man. Why don't I cheat in this one? Because I didn't make any mistakes that would even require me to cheat. <laughs> ladder is so, so long. Alright, so I think I'm gonna go back and get some spells and stuff before I kill Stray. Oh, nice skull miner. Yeah, I can imagine.
You can get so much Estus early on in this game. It's kind of crazy. The Grass Crest worth using. I mean, what else would I use? I mean, casting spells uses stamina in this game. So, it's worth using. It does put me above 30%, but... I don't know, being under 30%... Oh, shit. Also, I just... I didn't... Well, whatever, it's fine. Forgot to uh, attune... Create Fireball. This will st still do pretty good damage, though. It's still doable. Great. Uh, this doesn't count as a boss, but he gives, uh, gives a really good spell. Yeah, you can escape his grab once he catches you. You spam the trigger buttons. But he's generally going to do a little bit of damage to you, unless you're like Omega Insane Masher. What are the trigger buttons on keyboard? I don't know. I don't play this game on keyboard mouse. Click is what it is in Dark Souls 2, so. Do not sell that soul. <laughs> do not sell that. Do not want to do that. Do not what? Do I have enough attunement to put on Great Fireball? Or it's Fire Orb, actually. Uh, let's go do Great Wood. I think we've probably got enough Nestus, I hope. I don't know, maybe maybe fire orb's not a good idea.
No, I haven't. I heard that there's a new DLC for Blasphemous. Is it? Is it good? Alright, I'll grab this just in case. Somehow I can't kill Greatwood. It should be okay, though. I played one of Blasphemous. I thought it was quite fun. But, uh, I played I played one of the DLCs for Blasphemous, and it was like it was a uh, it was all right. But the final boss was kind of it's kind of like disappointing. Because the final, it was weird, there was these like four bosses that you fought and then you unlocked the final boss, but then the final boss was basically just the, uh, it was the four bosses you fought before but all combined into one. like that concept. I, I wasn't a huge fan because the final boss was like a little disappointing for me because I, I it was like it was pretty easy because I had already fought the other bosses and learned their movesets. just hit. What? What the hell? Whoa. What? What did I hit there? Did I hit his, like, face or something? Now we got the best pyromancy in the game. <laughs> 14... 18, 18. Hey, it, it's labeled as a pyromancy, alright. <laughs> Are there any good pyromancies that were added in the DLCs? There is the... I think the Demon Princes give the... the, like, delayed explosive one, right? Flame fan. Yeah, Seething Chaos. Steven Chaos did pretty good damage, but it was kind of hard to use. Alright, here we go, chat.
settle down. How much does the fire orb do? It's not bad. Not as good as the boulder. <laughs> Just let me spit on you. Dude. I hope I have enough ash in Estus. The, hey, listen, all right, here, look. look. Where's the damn spell? It's a pyromancy. It says it right there. Art of a stray demon of stifled flame. Pyromancy. Another pyro run where he abuses Boulder. Yeah, listen, I love this spell. Alright. Skipping two tomes. Uh I don't think I am. Oh god. <laughs> this is what you get for cheating. <laughs> All right, dude. again. Hopefully actually hit this jump this time. Dude, can I stop fucking sliding off the ledge? Mocha, thank you for the prime sub. Well, at least I have full ash, uh, full FP now. I don't think I need much for Wolnir. Yeah, no, I don't need the Karthus Pyromancy. I will get the Dark Pyromancies in the Wolnir fight here. 
And I'm gonna get the Isolith one as well. vaping. Do I prefer mana based or spell based? Uh, well, I th I kind of like the mana system. I do wish there was a bit. I don't know. I wish there was like a better way of recovering mana. Like I think if there were melee weapons that restored FP or something, that'd be pretty cool. Just like if you hit the boss, you just get FP back. Something like that. Just. When you're when you're out of Ash and Estus, you're just fucked. You know what? Let's let's bring this boy in uh, all the way down here. He needs to fight some skellies. Don't go after me, go after him. Did they not kill him yet? Dude, he's at... He's at one health! <laughs> what the fuck? Skeletons are worthless. Hey, Nova. How's it going? Get the Mimic to kill it. Yeah, the Mimic is... The Mimic does a lot of damage, but it's... He's a little unreliable. Sometimes he'll try to grab... He'll try to grab uh, the demon and then he just does nothing. Okay, please don't go out of bounds, Mr. Lizard. Thank you.
Yeah, Pyroglove is reinforced with Titanite in this game. Dude, my timing is just... Fireballs. Yeah, I definitely can. Pretty quick. Hey, it gives a bone shard. It's kind of nice. <laughs> I'm not using lightning stake. Lightning stake is really freaking good, though. It's like one of the best miracles in the game. I don't know why they put the swarm in the game. I mean, it's cool, but yeah, he's he he's not that. He's not that strong. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna quit out because these enemies are gonna chase me or fuck me up when I drop down here. I'm gonna grab the bonfire here too, just in case. Star, thank you for the gift sub to Nova. Thank you, thank you. Oh no! Don't, don't do it! Oh god! Oh, oh, oh my freaking god, dude! Oof. Yo, thank you so much for the raid, Hub. <laughs> What's going on, guys? I'm doing Pyro only for the Three Souls games. I'm sure, well, a lot of you hot viewers have seen Pyro only. Does this demon give a Pyro? No, I don't think so. I think he gives demon fists in the Great Axe. Chaos, Fire Orb. Do I want anything else? There. Oh, there is actually a cool glitch you can do. You know, let, we'll try it out. Oh yeah, he doesn't take the Grave, the Grave Warden one. Bob couldn't beat Ludwig. Ludwig's tough, dude. <laughs> I hope you had a good stream, Hob. Twenty-five. Dang it, I'm so close.
Actually, we're gonna go do dancer anyways. Do I have enough with Great Chaos Fire Orb? I need to get one more Ash and Estus, I think. Okay. Six four should do it. Or we should be able to kill Dancer now. Dude, I already have plus five. Goodness. Uh, right dancer. I'm, like spacing out right now. I'm gonna have plus six here. Ow. Which one did I not get? So you've never done no hit. Bloodborne plus DLC hob. Did you only do you only did like any percent, I guess? And that's really that I'm so surprised actually. Uh I don't know, it should be like nine hours or so. Alright, I'm just gonna punch her. So bad at it, yeah. The DLC takes a lot of practice, but luckily, well, I don't know what kind, I don't know what the no-hit strats are like for Bloodborne. There is there's like a strat that you can kill Lawrence without getting hit at all. Like you just stun him from full to dead. But it's kind of precise. And then Orphan, there's some like you, Do you guys allow like cheese for Orphan? Like the the parry loop, for example. Oh shit. Uh Downtown. Nice miss, dude. Stop, do stop doing that attack, dancer. shards I'm not talking about shards though oh in cathedral yeah but I haven't killed sage yet but yeah you're right I mean I, I could have got I could get the, the shard there what was the glitch you wanted to show oh yeah let me go uh, there's like a cool glitch you can do with fire surge and the bow I believe you can do like running firestorm I believe We'll go try that. I'm not sure exactly how to do it, but I I think it's pretty easy. Yeah, yeah. If you use the Witch Tree Bellvine, you don't need the Sage's Ring. That's correct. An awesome choice, stranger. What is this DS1? Yeah. I've never done this before, so I'm actually kind of excited to try it. Let's 
see, what did he drop? Great axe? Large shard. I don't really need that. Since I'm already at plus seven. Hey, Isaac from Google. Thank you for the sub, man. You did... I don't know if you're still here, Hob, but you did um, all bosses plus DLC pyro only, right? In DS3? Don't think he's here anymore. Well, you're probably right, but still have to skydive. <laughs> Action one. All right, let's get plus eight. Uh, plus eight. Do I have? All right, I'll level up a bit. Get some more attunement. I think you want to get... Uh, 30-30 for Pyro. I'm going to go to High Wall, and we're going to get uh, the bow. I mean, skydiving can be a punishment if you're scared of heights. But at the same time, it's something... It's, I guess it's cool to say that you've done it. You don't have a parachute. Okay. I picked up a lot of embers. And I spent all my souls. Okay. Let's try this out. Wait, do I need the stats to use the bow? Yeah. I don't think I do. How do you do it? Can't it... I will kill Andre. You know what? Maybe I don't. Maybe I don't remember. Maybe I don't know how to do this. No, it doesn't seem like it works. There must. You can only swap that with the ledge drop. I think you might be right. Okay. Well, this was a waste of time. <laughs> Hold on, let me let me just try it with the chaos storm real quick. No, 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 don't why did I do this? Okay. <laughs> let's let's uh Let's go do Osiris. Yeah, there, there's a cool glitch you can do where you... You cast Chaos... You can cast, like, Firestorm or Chaos Storm as you're... As you're moving. It, it like, plays the animation using the Fire Surge spell. Yeah, that's how you do it, Skull Miner. You can also roll forward as well. I 
think one of my favorite things about doing these kind of runs in Dark Souls 3 is being super OP for Crystal Sage and Deacons. Or, or Watchers and Wolnir, depending on what kind of weapon you're doing. If you're doing a Titanite scale weapon, or no, Twinkling Titanite weapons, you can get plus 10 or plus 5 for uh, Abyss Watchers. It is so satisfying, like, pancaking the Abyss Watcher in two hits. <laughs> Uh, I don't really have enough Estus King Bacon to kill Greatwood early on. Not safely anyways. Right in the face. Oh my god. Are you hiding from me? Come out. Come out. Don't be afraid. You were born a child of Kratos. What could you possibly fear? Oh no. What in the world is going on? What? <laughs> Dude! <laughs> Man, locking on with this spell is really bad. Okay, dude. This guy, I, I can't fucking hit him. <laughs> and with the boulder. Okay. <laughs> fight was kind of slow. <laughs> I mean, we're making pretty good pace. We're... Let's see, we're an hour into the run. I remember watching you lose a run to this ledge, Hob. That was tragic, dude. <laughs> uh, Ob's nemesis, this wall. <laughs> Shit, I need to pick up one. Oh god, I don't like. I don't like having to pick this chunk up. Yeah, Do, have you tried using pyromancies in Dark Souls 2, huh? Have you tried using any magic in Dark Souls 2, for that matter? It's fucking horrible, dude. It is so bad.
Rip Gundir. Gundir gets bullied so hard. They really shouldn't have made it so you could parry him. <laughs> it like he just can't do anything. I mean, DS2 was okay. I didn't actually die that much. It's just, the game is just super freaking long, man. You want 30-30, right? Is it worth going... Actually, I think you want 35-35. Oh, is it 40-40? Let's get a little bit more health. Oh yeah, let's give her the eyes as well. Give her the eyes... Turn in the S this shard. Yeah, I think whenever whenever I do pyro runs, I would normally go 35, 35 maybe, but I'll go a little higher. Yeah, I'm gonna upgrade the pyro glove. I'm just, I'm turning in the, the infinite bone, so I can get in uh, Titanite Slab. Titanite Slab is kind of slow to get, but works out well. I kind of want to try Chaos Storm. I don't think it's going to be very good, though. I kind of want to... Well, okay, you know what? I'm not going to use it on Sage. I think I will try Chaos Storm for Deacons, at least. It'll be fun for Deacons. The spell buff doesn't increase that much. Upgrading the later levels, yeah. Going to plus 10 is, like, the most insignificant upgrade. At least for Catalysts. I, I think for Pyro Flame, the plus 10 upgrade is a bit more impactful. But I remember I would upgrade my... Like, when I do sorcery runs, I would upgrade the, the Catalyst to plus 10. And it would get, like, two extra spell buff. <laughs> like, why am I even bothering? Let's just pass right away. What the hell? I, uh, I thought she was going to spawn the, the illusions. Oh, weird. Why do I have a bow? Well, there's a cool glitch you can do where you cast spells. So... I can puke great chaos fi fire orbs, for example, or I could—I th think I can throw boulder heave, maybe. 
Let's see, can I can I do that? Oh, it's kind of weird. You can, but it's <laughs> it's kind of weird. Yeah, you can you can swap the animation from any spell to a different spell. It's like really easy to do. You just need a bow. Yeah, it's on current patch. Oh my god, these dogs, dude. I'm trying to put out here. Did the dogs die? Oh. I guess he killed both the dogs. Wow. <laughs> okay. If you want to do the glitch, all you do, so you cast a spell, and then make sure not to move at all, and then you backstep. Uh, you basically backstep. Hold on, let me kill this guy. So you cast a spell, you stand still, you backstep, and then you hold L2 and forward at the same time. And you can keep doing it over and over again, as long as you don't move. Pretty cool. I'm gonna turn on this Estus Shard. Oh, I probably shouldn't bother beating at meme runs. Yeah, dude. I've got the Divine Elixir, so. Fuck off! Fucking hell! Fuck! I'm getting a lot of that notification today. Thank you for the 51 months, Covenant of Souls. Alright, we're gonna put on Chaos Storm and... Let's, let's put on Fire Surge, why not? It'll be fine, right? No, you can't spell swap fire surge. You need to you need well you can, but you need to drop off a ledge to be able to do it. Apparently. Let me borrow that hoodie. Yeah, this is the Twitch hoodie that was released a while ago. Larksa bought it for me. Could probably get the witch tree bellvine. Oh yeah, so Hob. Uh, when is Hob's league starting? He, I, I guess, I guess it's public now because people are asking me about it. Hob invited me. I haven't, I haven't decided whether I want to do it yet. But, but sorry, sorry, uh, I haven't responded yet, Hob. <laughs> I'm not much of like a no-hit guy, but I mean, I, I think it would still be fun. Yeah, do you guys think Nems is actually gonna do it? I can't believe Nems said yes. I was actually like shocked. <laughs> Oh, is he just doing commentary? I thought he was doing like both. Ah, an awesome choice, Dave. Oh, he is doing both. Okay. I don't think they sell this hoodie anymore.
Yeah, the new Attack on Titan came out tonight. I'm gonna I'm excited to watch that. I think there's a new Demon Slayer episode that came out tonight too. Crunchyroll. Dang. Has Nems not streamed in a while? Dude, be <laughs> Nems barely streams. Nems streams like once a month. We're lucky. Demon Slayer episode was 10 out of 10. Oh shit. Yo, I'm actually pretty hyped then. Nice. Alright, let's hit him with the Chaos Storm. Oh! Dude, I'm gonna die trying to cast this fucking spell though. Shit is. Like, dude. Oh! Fuck! <laughs> man. This thing does some good damage, though. Summon. Yo, what's up, Kwitty? Fire Surge is actually decent. <laughs> Kinda. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta say, this was considerably slower than if I had just used Great Chaos Fire Orb, but I have no regrets. Alright, uh, let's go kill... I think I might just go kill, uh... Dragon Slayer Armor. I don't know how to do the move swap with Chaos Storm and Fire Surge. You need to you need a ledge to do it apparently. Oh shit. Oh, wait, no, I just swapped the ring. Okay. Thought I didn't have the ring equipped for that fight, but Am I not using the same three bell charm? I mean I have the Sage's ring right now. But I should go pick that up. Because I have the void sword now. I I can't I gotta go the I gotta go the long way now too, dude. <laughs> I'm out of the vomit leak. <laughs> yeah, that was a lot of hits there. <laughs> Pyromancy guy and lose life in fire. Yeah, that's true. Should be ashamed. I think py pyromancies are pretty freaking strong against dragons, their armor. If I remember right.
but I'm gonna get it. I'm dead. What? <laughs> what? The fu it's the fire clutch. It was the fire clutch plus the fucking counter hit, dude. Oh man. I was okay. All right, I gotta be more careful. I, I'll be, I'll be honest. Sometimes I'm like really greedy when I do these runs, just cause. I mean, it's not like I'm doing a no hit run. I don't, I don't care, but. I really. Knew, I knew I shouldn't have gone for that. I really, I was not expecting to get one shot. <laughs> it's fun being greedy. When it works out, it's really nice. But right there, that that was just stupid. I knew he was going to do the follow-up attack. Alright, here we go. Round two. It's all good. Can you parry dragons their armor? I don't think so. Can you? Actually? Yes? Wait, really? Ashen one. Well, very good. Dang, I had no idea. I feel like I should get some more attunement. Oh, I don't know. I mean, I have enough for two chaos orbs. I guess it's fine. Or for four chaos orbs, rather. Can you parry Mirror Knight? I don't know. Yeah, Vellstop parry is pretty flashy. No, I haven't killed old Demon King yet. <laughs> Iromancies are honestly so, <laughs> so strong. Vestiges. I don't really like Vestige that much. Tell you the truth.
It uses so much FP and it doesn't really do m more damage than Chaos Chaos Fire Orb. At least if you get the, the lingering damage hit with the Chaos Orb. I won't help series. Uh, no. Let's do the controller skip. Oh god, that was terrible. I really should have my keybind set up for this. <laughs> Third try. I want to go do Eldritch and Pontiff right now. I don't know. I, I guess we'll go get the Dark Pyros. Normally I just skip the Dark Pyros and spam Boulder Heave, but I'll uh, I'll go for the Dark Pyros on this run. Cause I haven't done it in a while. They're really not worth getting, but. We'll do it anyways. Dude, Inner Father fucked me up so bad. I I raged pretty hard at the the Mortal Gauntlet and Sekiro. I was doing it with no, uh, Demon Bell and no Kuro Charm though. Just making it way worse. I haven't gotten the Mimic head in a long time, dude. Bad RNG. get one from this guy. What's in this one? Selkie. Centiloper, thank you for the six months, man. Here we go with this. Sh Rats are kind of scary. <laughs> So to free Carla, we gotta go. We just gotta go through like the swamp area and then go down to the end of that tunnel, I think, and get the key. Then we can free her on the way to Wyvern. I 
don't know. I think there's a lot of replayability in these games, just trying different builds. You know, I mean, no damage, obviously, and like speed running add even more replayability, but. I'm just, I'm so excited to just do a bunch of different builds in Elden Ring. I can't wait to, I gotta say, I'm like super hyped for the magic in Elden Ring. They, it seems, it seems there's a lot of cool, a lot of really cool magic. Just from what we've seen so far. <laughs> um, yeah. Shit game. I have a feeling that there's gonna be some really fucking cool magic in Elden Ring. Excited for the exploration in the world. I'm just excited for everything, man. I like... I've, I've, I've literally said, I, every single day I just say how excited I am for Elden Ring and I'm not, I'm not gonna stop. I'm gonna say it every day until it comes out, dude. It's gonna be content for like two years, yeah, dude. Just so much stuff to do, I'm so excited. Are you, uh, are you gonna be doing any, like, PvP hub? Maybe some Elden Ring speed runs? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm sure you're probably <laughs> trying to get no hit like world first. Finally do some PvP, but your Sekiro speedruns were major trash. It'd be cool to see you do some speedruns, actually. Holy shit, this is so hot. I mean, it would- it would probably be nice- I feel like speedruns would- well, I don't know- I don't know if you're really interested in speedruns, but... It'd be probably a nice change of pace for you not having to worry about getting hit. Stalling is most of the combat. We're gonna do the we're, we're gonna we're gonna use my fist for wyvern. I'm sorry, guys. His head is too. His head. Uh, this always happens to me. His head is so close to the ledge. Just get Dark Orb and Melt Wyvern. It's so boring though, man. All you do is just hide in a safe spot and just cast like 60 times in a row. Like, guys, you're not missing out on anything. Missed out on Chain Snake. I mean, there's there's other safe spots that you can attack him from, uh, that aren't all the way at the top. I like Chain Snake. Hey, swimmer. Dark Souls 2 was uh long, very long. 
And Pirate, thank you for the 17 months. Oh man, I'm freaking hungry right now, guys. I ate before the stream, but I'm I'm getting pretty hungry again. Hey, Extazor, thank you for the gift sub, man. I ate like eight hours ago, yep. Yeah. Let's go get the dark pyromancies. Wait, shit! Oh, chat. Forgot to free Carla. I am gonna free her now. But it would have been very efficient if I did it earlier. Luckily, she's not that far away. Hopefully there's some cool daggers in Elden Ring. Yeah. I've never really been a big fan of daggers. I, mu I much prefer, like, hard-hitting weapons, but... Yeah, there was... There was, like, the... That one dagger in the network test. That was pretty cool. Good. Farewell, Yeah, we'll go do Yorm now. Have you seen the great bow glitch in this game, Hop? I'm sure you probably have, right? Are dark pyromancies better overall? Uh, the great bow glitch, where you can like rapid fire the great bow. <laughs> the boat glitch. <laughs> Great boat. Yeah, the clutch rings work for spells. I wasn't actually hitting him in the head there. Oh, that did just work. Yeah, there's like an even more OP glitch hub. Or you can you can fire ten great bow arrows in like rapid succession. You can you can pretty much kill any boss in like twenty seconds. <laughs> it's 
It's not actually used in the speedrun though. You need to get a. Uh, you need to get Gale's repeating crossbow. To be able to do it. Worst glitch ever discovered. I assume. Have you seen the? <laughs> have you seen the cannon stuff up? You joined the run too late? Uh, I mean, no, there's still, there's still a lot of this run left. We still have Aldrich, Princes, uh, all the DLCs. Why do I need Storm Ruler? I might try to do the elevator clip. I don't know, we'll see. Pro actually, I probably won't. I don't have ball control, so, or the cat ring. Elevator clip is super weird. It's like, it's just not consistent, really. <laughs> Everything. Yeah. Nem's nemesis is the entire game. Bill, I need to heal. fine. Everything's fine. I do need to change my ring, you're right. I also should get the Witch Trinity Bellvine.
Well, that wasn't very good. You know, I'll be honest, I'm actually kind of curious how you guys do this fight in the no-hit run. Because I feel like even parrying, it, parrying isn't even really safe. No, 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 I, I don't mean, um, I, I don't mean, like, normal no-hit run. With I'm not talking about melee. I mean, like, if you're doing, a uh, pyromancy. Like, melee pontiff is super easy. streamed in a year. Dang, dude. Harry and Great Combustion. Oh, yeah. Great Combustion makes more sense. That's That spells quite fast. Also, I don't have the Witch Tree Belvine or, like, the Sage's Ring on right now. Alright. I gotta go. I gotta go get the Witch Tree Belvine after I kill, uh, Aldrich. Game looks ten times better on PC than on the consoles. I don't know. I think it... I don't... Well, I haven't played Dark Souls 3 on console before. Or not in a long time anyways, so... I thought I was going to die there. <laughs> He's not gonna follow you, Sergeant. I am just... Dude, can I fucking aim? <laughs> no hit Aldridge. Dude, the 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 glove start counts as a pyro. Come on, man. Get out of here. Uh right. So yeah, let's go get the witch tree. The witch tree Belvine. Yo, what's up, Andy? Also, uh, Slith, thank you so much for the two months.
passion and love. Uh, I'll probably play the demo for Nightfall. We'll see. All right, forty forty chat. We've done it. What if Nightfall is better than Elden Ring? That would be... That would be an astonishing feat. Alive. Guess we'll do princes. Guys, come on, man. I'm hitting him with a glove that does like 30 damage. <laughs> if anything, I'm making it harder. Yeah, hey, so Andy, thank you for the sub, man. pyro spell for a boss run uh i mean bold boulder heave is the best o overall pyromancy in my opinion it has low fp cost and it does really good poise damage just does good damage in general No, I haven't done any of the DLC yet. Just clearing up the main game right now. Yeah. I mean, that's what makes the spell so good. Everything in Dark Souls 3 is weak to physical damage. Or not weak, but rather not resistant. Does RTSR work with Pyro? I believe it does. But you can also just use, uh, you can just use Lloyd's Sword Ring, and it's not as big of a damage boost, but it's not much lower, and you don't have to be one hit from dead. How did I get powerful so fast? It's just, uh, knowing where to pick up all the upgrades and stuff. I mean, I'm pretty- I'm two hours into the run now, so... 
It's not like it was that fast. But py Pyromancy can get very strong early on. All the magic types in this game get strong early on if you know what to do. And then you have Dark Souls 2 where it's like, you literally plan everything ahead and you still... Like, you, you try to min-max perfectly to do as much damage as possible, and you still don't do anything. Yeah, Magic when DS2 came out was better, but it still wasn't that good, in my opinion. Alright, Imperius. Have a good night. Another dogged contender. Welcome, unkindled one. Purloiner of cinders. Mind you. The mantle of Lord interests me none. The fire linking curse, the legacy of Lords, let it all fade into nothing. You've done quite enough. Now have your rest. Hexes used to be really good, yeah. Oh, I should have been using the bell vine. Whoops. So, I think... I can't remember if Dark Orb is better for uh, the bird here. I think it might be. I believe the Pyromancy Flame is better. Holy shit, RTSR setup.
Imagine being able to aim. Farewell, Ashen One. A heart out. All right, I got chaos bed for you, chat. Missing one Estus shard, but it should be fine. I did. I, I think I activated the elevator in archives, anyways. So if I need to, I can go get that Estus shard. Should be fine, though. I wonder how fast you could actually do a, like an optimized run of Pyro in DS3. Also, 30 blades. Thank you for the 14 months. <clears throat> oh man, kind of tired, chat. But we, we're we're getting close to the end. I mean, I'm not saying you're going to beat the record, the all-bosses record doing Pyro's King Kong. I, I'm just kind of thinking, like, I wonder how fast it could actually be if you, if you routed it. Nice skip. I get the pants chat. I'll get the pants. Skip hard to learn. No, it's not that bad. Beautiful.
<laughs> that disrespect. I didn't want to wait for the vow to end. <laughs> I didn't want to cheese him. I mean, I kind of cheesed him anyways, but... I didn't push him off the ledge. Onyx Blade run. Yeah, maybe I'll do some more meme runs with BS3 soon. I'm using Onyx Blade this run, though. running DS3 before Elden Ring comes out, yeah, but, I mean, you don't use Onyx Blade with the DS3 speedrun. Man, Wilhelm Skip is so nice for this DLC. Probably would have tried to do it if I had fall control. Probably should, I, I should, probably should have got fall control, but it's not a big deal. Get the DS3 recce, dude. The DS3 recce is really hard. The sexy underwear. Uh, it's in the building. It's in the building before you jump on, like, the roof. It, the the building with the ladder. Um, yeah, it's there. Or I'm trying to just think about how to describe where it is. Gail's diaper is sexy. <laughs> Bob's into some. He's into that shit, dude. <laughs> he used a D's nuts joke. Oh, Ellen. Alright, I honestly don't know if I'm gonna have enough Ash and Estes to do this. I'm a little concerned. The Desert Pyro set. Damn, she is just taking it, dude. I want to do another DS3 viewer run soon. So much fun heal sniping with the projected heal. Oh, 
probably I could have went for a punch there. Really? He's probably gonna dodge this. She can do that actually. Don't dodge. You. Oh, I thought she was gonna do the follow up. Oh, that's fine. Shit, I don't have my uh, bell vine. Uh, insane no hit Frida. <laughs> yeah, I'm so ready for Vomit League. Hell yeah, dude. Ever done a luck a luck run? Well the speed run for Dark Souls 3 used to use luck. We actually we used to use Andre's straight sword with uh Parthus Rouge. But yeah, they nerfed it. It's not quite quite that good anymore, unfortunately. Yeah, the ass to ass route, dude. Those were the days. Alright, I'm gonna have to use Boulder Heave on Demon Princes. It's just, it's horrible without Boulder Heave. What is happening? No, I still need to do Grave Tender. Good enough. Alright, let's go do Grave Tender right now then. Yeah, Warden Twin Blades are crazy good.
And going to Grave Tender the normal way is so slow. Oh man, I... Oh jeez. Thought I was going to miss the branch there. <laughs> that was really close. According to plan. Come on. Let me hit you. <laughs> there we go. game. Farewell, Ashen One. I was an HP. I mean, I don't really have anything else to level up. Like, I'm at 40-40. I could get a bit more endurance, I guess. That that would actually be kind of nice. But maybe I should have equipped Dark Lord. speed difference without the bell line is crazy. Just cancel it all. 
Alright, this isn't good. Stun soon. Oh. How have I not stunned him yet? There we go. No, SS cancel isn't that hard. I kind of just like wing it, but my problem is I do the time. I do the timing too early. I'm still not really exactly sure what the inputs are for it either. If I actually just sat down and practiced it, it would be a lot better. is so good. Do this run tomorrow again no i will be back to scholar tomorrow most likely i maybe i might do like a ds1 rando run soon uh but we'll see probably more scholar tomorrow try to get the 210 Yeah, I want to do, like, Fog, fog Gate, Enemy, Item, Rando, with, uh, like, auto-equip. No more Sekiro run? Dude, I haven't ran Sekiro in a long time. But I might, I might run Sekiro a little bit before Elden Ring. We'll see. No, sub, sub two hours is not possible. Man, your health bar in Dark Souls 3 can get so big. Kind of crazy. Oh yeah, by the way guys, on GDQ, uh, a really cool runner named Mitch on the final day is going to be doing Blindfolded Sekiro. So I would definitely recommend checking that out. If you were not aware, should be pretty hype. Many of us are blind of fighting. Yeah, it's blindfolded the whole run. Use this magician's blindfold? No. No, it's 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 completely legit. There's a lot of like really tricky setups and stuff. No partake skip. No, I'm I'm on current patch. No, it's not tomorrow. It's the final day of GDQ, so like in a week. Yeah. 
You and Hob got me so hyped for Elden Ring. Gonna try playing through all six Souls games each weekend. Yo, nice, dude. That's awesome. Breaking the boss's AI to the point where they can't do anything. I mean, I don't know what you're talking about. Because there isn't... You don't really break the AI in any of the, the blindfold in any of the blindfolded run. I mean, you use Mortal Blade, which is really strong. A lot of the setups and stuff rely on using like the the rice and the pellets and whatnot. getting Genny stuck in a corner. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't think you can do... Actually, I don't know. I don't... Do they get Genny stuck in the corner for the blindfold run? I guess maybe they do. I have no idea. I haven't watched a full run. I guess, I guess they probably do. That's... I imagine that would be the easiest way. Yeah, Mitch doesn't actually have the record for blindfolded. There's, there's some like Japanese dude, or I don't. It doesn't matter. There's there's another runner who who beat Mitch's time like quite a bit recently. Yeah, on Billy Billy. That was a- wait, it was a fake run? I didn't watch it, so I wouldn't be surprised. I'm not Brazil. Hoping to get that that break. So I'll be honest. I don't, do pyros even do anything to Madeir, like dark or fire? I think he's pretty resistant to both. If we use Boulder Heat, we have enough Estus. He's super resistant to dark. I think you pretty much need to use Boulder Heat for this guy as well. Unfortunately, there isn't really any solution. There, there really isn't any alternative other than Boulder Heat. Unless I want to go into the fight with 14 Ashenestus.
see how much a great chaos fire orb does to him. It actually still does a decent bit. Just uses twice the FP. Great Chaos Fireball five times before I need to uh, restore. attack like him just yeah just a, constantly yoling like that is so fun How did that hit him? I feel like these load screens are taking a really long time. Hey, Lincolnstein, thank you for the two-year resub. for the best boss. Yeah, we've got some cheese for him, though. Rum is not valid if this isn't done online. <laughs> yes, because speedrunning online is something that's very common. All the runners do it. Dude. 
Bro, are you really healing back there? Please stop that. We can do one more big level up, I guess. Why'd I bother with the boulder? The boulder's good. You can keep knocking him over with it. You can, I mean, you saw I was like kind of stun locking him. But it's not, uh, not fully consistent. Let's do one, one final level up for Gale. Yeah, you don't get like anything from that. 30-30, sure. Actually, I probably should have got some more endurance. Afraid that I feel like the music might be too loud. <laughs> oh, Staggers. <laughs> Hey, Human Wine, thank you so much for the Prime sub.
spamming a bit too many heals. Save and we're good from around. Finish that. He doesn't actually have, even though I have fast casting speed, he doesn't really have that much. something that I can Thank you. Alright guys, final boss. Let's do it. Freaking hungry, chat. Nice. Alright, here we go. Actually, not doing as much as I expected. It's not bad. Can't dodge chat.
All right, chat. Is Miyazaki? What is me? <laughs> so we are going to leave the fate of the Firekeeper up to Miyazaki, as we always do. Now, Miyazaki has been very friendly lately. So, uh, well, let's let's see what happens. Oh, Miyazaki. <laughs> He's feeling angry. <laughs> it's been a while since we've got this, actually. Hey, also, uh, DSF, thank you so much for the 27 months. Yeah, my character's got a... I, somebody told me to increase chest size, so I, I made my character have a really big chest. Quickly fades. Darkness will shortly settle. Elden Ring. Hey, Skull Miner, thank you so much for the gift sub. But one day, tiny flames will dance across the darkness. You die of poison in this cutscene? I don't know. <laughs> it's just a tombstone behind her. Her fate ha yeah, her fate has been sealed, fellas. Sorry, chat. This is what Miyazaki wanted. I think I should have taken off my pants. No barefoot step. <laughs> Nameless, accursed, undead. Unfit even to be cinder. I'm a monster? Hey, so listen. Miyazaki. Miyazaki chose this. This wasn't my doing. All right, GG. What are you trying for with the white branch? When you use the white branch, there's two different things you can become. You either become a tombstone or you, be you become a still like rock formation thing. And depending on which one you get, that is how we decide. He's back, chat. Oh, look, she's dancing. All right. Oops. Well, GG, fellas. It has been a fun stream, uh, but I am going to go get some dinner. I'm going to call it a night here. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the run. I will be putting, uh, I'll be 